Okay, Welcome well. to the live. <laughs> it has been, I think, a year. You're or fully half a, a year. year. No, no half, since we did the last live. Yeah, since we did a live stream, it's been a year. What has it been? Yeah, so it's been a yeah. while. We already got uh, <laughs> some questions coming in. Yeah. And uh, yeah, we're just going to kind of just sit down and talk. It's not really anything much. Yeah. Besides uh, just a yearly yearly live stream of talking. Yeah, we s always say we want to do them more often, the live streams, but we never really have, have the, the time. time. And we always have to pre-schedule it, of course. And then we're always like, oh, we should have done the live then because we just don't want to just go live randomly. I don't know if you would enjoy that, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> just to go randomly live. But yeah, we always have to pre-schedule it. And then some other things come up, more work. So it's always a bit of a mess to pre-schedule it. But uh, yeah, we are just going to answer some questions, I guess and yeah. uh, give you an update on some things. I don't know if I'm gonna show you too much around because it is getting dark. That's why you can see we, have, <laughs> we haven't taken down those Christmas lights. Those are like always saying Christmas yeah. lights. Just, they just, light up yeah. the room, but not so bright as the main lights. Yeah. So people are just joining in. Um, yeah, I'm gonna wait a bit before it gets started. So what is the time? It's uh, six o'clock, exactly. Six in the afternoon. Evening, yeah. Not in the morning, <laughs> we're not early birds. <laughs> So it's uh it's it's getting dark. It's actually the sun setting a lot later than uh, usual. So it's a bit different. It's been three so, years. Yeah, Michelle has been watching us for three years, supporting yeah, us. Yeah, like, been a lot. Steady support yeah. from her. <laughs> all the comments, all the recommendations to subscribe. She's been here since pretty much days yeah. one. So it's amazing. So what do we get? Sorry, is there any question? I don't see. I I don't have glasses, on, so I need to go very close and yeah, look stay weird. a little bit high up as well. <laughs> Yeah, we're sitting currently on our, I don't know if we should show you, kind of a bit maybe, like here's the kitchen, Yeah. and we're sitting currently on the, <laughs> how's it called, our workstation, workstation. Kind of we have like two, one in the bedroom, one here, so that's our second workplace, so that's where we are. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, in the in US is morning, it's not the best time for people working, but uh, yeah. it was the best time for us like to do it, oh, we could have done it on Saturday as well. Yeah, we also okay. have lots of thinking so people not wake up so early on a Saturday morning because usually Saturdays are the days where you no, you sleep in. So I decided maybe Friday is better. And it is actually also exactly four, three years, three years that we are here exactly to the today. Today, We yeah. saw the house I for think, the first right? time. 24th. Yeah, 24th. Yeah. I think, 24th. I don't remember, it was 24th, 25th. I think we arrived 23rd in Latvia and 24th we came to see the house. And uh, yeah, since then we haven't left the house really. Yeah, <laughs> since three years. It's been a journey. It's it's a lot of times hard to realize how much it has changed the place from like what it was when we first came in. It was completely awful comparably. So yeah. it's been it's been a journey. It's harder sometimes. Like you need a bit of a like to realize yourself yeah. that what you have done because we just and not only in house like what we have done in the house in three years, but also outside in the gardens and yeah. animal homestead everything like we said yesterday i think has it actually been three years because it feels like six yeah it feels <laughs> a lot longer a lot way more years that we have been doing and been here we're just so much focused on doing the next thing that we never realized like what we have actually done yeah. but yeah it's uh, good to watch back the videos and realize like how much actually has changed the place it's crazy uh, Thank you so much for all your sweet comments, first of all. <laughs> yeah, the comments and support. It's just, it's it's um, it's amazing to be able to do what we're doing. is like renovating our house, showing it to you guys and having it as our job instead of, you know, pretty much not doing much renovation if you had yeah. to work and we wouldn't have the time. So it is a lot, like, for us to have this in yes. our life. I don't think we could have done work plus... Uh, renovation not youtube at not least. yeah no. i guess we would not have the time or we would not have progressed that much either because it takes a lot of effort a lot of time and a lot of power yeah it's um it's a lot of lot of work um just to maintain it even not even just renovating that's that's another yes. story um your farm's looking good keep up the good work your beautiful farmhouse yeah it's it's getting there soon soon it's gonna be you know getting better and better yeah I think once we get I through all the, the jobs. I think like, with our um, said farm as well, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, with our farm, I think we are for now, we are done with animals. Like them, what yeah. kind of we're animals we want to get. We're about. We have one more wish is ducks. Ducks, ducks yeah. And Maybe a duck house. Our geese currently are mating. I don't know if you can hear them. Yeah, they're know. screaming <laughs> around. But the uh, chicken house is nearly done. Yeah. It's like a few days from being fully finished from moving them. 
and goats are in a stable nice warm house yeah. just need to finish it it's also not it's just the, the best. beauty part like uh, it is all functioning they have a roof up over the head that it's all more or less sealed yeah as we said chickens a question about yeah. chickens uh we are they're not in yet but they will be in a few days it's fingers crossed very close end of the upcoming week end of yeah end of the start of the week. new month <laughs> yeah start of march in yeah. um and uh, have you had any side jobs lately none at all i don't think we have had I did one wedding. I did wedding for that video was like shoot, but that's two years ago. That was two years ago. So no, <laughs> we've just been focusing on this. Yeah, it's been it's been. We do. A I don't know if that counts. Like as a side job, we do um, speakings on. I don't know how's it called. The, um, in the universities. Yeah, we it's do kind of, for um, in Singapore. We do um, yearly, pretty much. We do twice a year sometimes. I forgot. Um, what presentation. Oh, presentations. Yes. Yeah, in front of <laughs> thousands of students. And uh, which is crazy to be invited to. Yeah, to be uh, like a couple that is like a young kids that are inspiring others. It's very weird for us to yeah. like be inspiring others, <laughs> like even older our age or younger our age. It's pretty crazy to think. So yeah, that's kind of what we've been doing. But rather than that, yeah. like, we have no time for anything else really. How do you learn all the things we do? Um, I don't know, by doing? By doing, yes. <laughs> a lot of things like you just kind of know and a lot of things you learn until you fade. Yeah, until you learn them. Uh, why do you keep the old car in the camper, but do nothing with them? Old yeah. car, I have a plan with it, but um, it's kind of just don't have time for it. But um, either if I if I don't do it, just gonna go for scrap. But I will try to do it. And for the camper, now, we will renovate and um, either we sell it. Yeah, which or... we don't really want, but yeah. if we have to, we will. But yeah. we do want to restore it a bit and it then sell it for like yeah, for bigger sure. profit, of course. And also the car currently is. Pepe's favorite and chickens are having mud bath below it. So <laughs> yeah, we'll see the car, the, yeah. the old car. There, I, mean, that's, I don't like it sitting there either. I don't. Yeah, it's not my favorite look. But someone said if when we are bit. done renovating, fixing the house, we're gonna stay or move. I think we're gonna stay. I want to. We're gonna move. Yeah. I think we're gonna stay. Like so much work we'll put in this. It's it's a lot of work to start something else again. Yeah. It's just so much. Unless there's something like we have a very big income and we buy something ready or like. Yeah. But it's but... gonna be same style. I think it's gonna be a farmhouse, maybe just bigger. So. Yeah. <laughs> Upstairs is gonna be quite a journey, but yeah. uh, expensive with these new prices, it's just crazy to to even start planning it out. So we'll see if we We're if we if we manage slowly. it this year. It's all up to like how it goes with yeah. YouTube. If YouTube decides to help <laughs> us out, then we're gonna be doing upstairs in no time. But uh, for now, we have to finish the downstairs. Yeah, floor. like we were dedicated with a goat house. We were struggling with it, and then we got this big boost of YouTube, and we're yeah. able to finance it. I think we did it in two months. less than two months. Less than two months. Well, because yeah. of the weather, the weather was pretty bad. So if we're dedicated, we can get it done. If the finances are there and everything, yeah. then. We're pretty fast at the getting projects done. Yeah, I was starting gardening this year. Um, we're excited, but uh, <laughs> it's stressful again. And we haven't even plowed our land yet, which has yeah. to be done in autumn. So the tractor really kept us behind on that. So we'll have to see if we can get the land plowed, even if it's not too muddy. And, I think um, we March says so it's gonna can... be pretty dry. Hopefully the ground, um, the top layer rots away so we can actually start cultivating yeah. and planting. We are actually planning to swap the fields. We're going where the goats were, where the heralds are currently. So that's where we'll be swapping it to. Yeah. How is the basement? Something else I don't know. How the basement's oh. coming along. Uh, it's it's a lot of dirt to dig yeah. out beyond. Um, like three, four tons. Maybe of dirt, I would say, mm -hmm. estimating. Yeah, and then all the water and then all the stones. I don't even stones, want to think about Stones we have it. to take out. We have to dig a bit deeper than what the floor is actually. So we have to take out the stone floor and we have to dig it deeper, put concrete and all the rest. It's just a mess. So it's going to be slow. Take one day to time to fix your beautiful farmhouse. Yeah. It's a, it's a lot of work to fix a house, especially yeah. so old. Um, it, it would be easier to fix, build a new one, but it wouldn't be... Anywhere near Anywhere the, the character as well. Character and the beauty. And, and the quality. The quality, of course, <laughs> is very good as well. The way it's built is so good. Someone actually said at the very, very start to show Evie how she is doing. So we can bring, I can bring her in. And yeah. I have Katie actually here as well. Katie is actually, doing both good. Of our, both of our animals are here. <laughs> Katie is doing good. Yeah. She's actually scared of phones and cameras. I don't know. She's, no, cameras not, but phones. She's pretty scared. Oh, Katie, don't you? She's holding. She always wants to be with us. That's why she was laying here on the carpet on this side. Yo. And yeah, she's doing good. 
She's doing fine. And Evie? And Evie's doing perfectly fine. Her tail is back to normal. Yeah. No problem at all. Oh, Evie. Signs of pregnancy, definitely uh, one of the goats are getting big, so we'll see. It's a few months only left. Not much. You okay? She was having a sleep, but you need to wake you up because whenever she sleeps all day, she keeps us awake. No, when she sleeps all day, she keeps us awake all night. So yeah, we have to wake her up once in a while so we're going to sleep at night. But yeah, you can see her tail is fine. She's like trying to put it in there. Yeah? Kate does look a bit like Corgi. She's something like a small hunting dog, something. Not unsure of what breed she is. Yeah. Thank you so much. It's all kind comments. Yeah, Evie. Permaculture gardening, have you looked into this? Which, what? What was it? A permaculture gardening. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I wasn't able to explain it. I, I have heard about it, but yeah. I haven't looked into it now. Our gardening, no, our no. gardening is plow a giant field, put fertilizer I on do. it and plant. Yeah. I just plant there. Yeah. I have tried to look into like how to make our garden look nice and like, like kind of design it. Stuff. But then I look all of those like kind of backyard raised bed gardens and it's like nothing that fits us or like is our thing that we're doing because we're just putting everything on a big piece of land. Yeah, if we have no problem with the land, so we're just so, able to yeah. just do a giant field and uh, plant everything. So we cannot really make it beautiful and cute. Yeah, <laughs> we can put some herbs like we do as a Yeah, wanna, we have the garden beds and we want to put there some herbs and some like dill and onions like things yeah. for the gar like for the food for cooking and then like bigger things will go in the field but i don't know how to make it look cute and nice yeah it's, it's like it's a lot of open flat. space as well it's hard yeah. to make it so homey and it's like not it like is. something that we want to keep it will be swapping it every three years so we refresh the land so yeah you cannot do something permanently there what's the plans for apartment rental or storefront i mean we don't have any store to put there that would be interesting <laughs> Um, there's not really enough audience in that city, like yeah. not audience, um, like customers to really put a store there. It's actually business is closing there, but uh, rental apartment probably is going to be uh, for a holiday rental. So any of you guys could you, yeah. rent it out, no problem. <laughs> and but, you can come also visit here, but yeah, you like you as a visit, there, yeah. yeah. So um, what of your hard working people? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. So a great example of make do with what you have. Thank you. Yeah, I always like to reuse things. So we we pretty much every wood that we take down we use unless it's rotten or you know too far gone. But um, and every, overall things. Everything. Yeah, like the bricks I'm now taking out of the roll. I'm have to sort them out and go through them, and that's going to be used to build a lot of things from the old bricks, and they're you know valuable bricks. Um, so yeah, what else Maybe? is there? Permacolor is very pretty. Yeah, it's a. Uh, I'm not sure what permaculture exactly. Like, is it? Uh, is it where you where you do no dig gardening or something like that? Something similar to that. Or I'm not sure. I'll yeah. I'll look into it. But uh, for us, fertilized field is the. Yeah, easiest. we have the goats currently. The goats have been on it for two years, so they are pretty fertilized. Yeah, yeah, and we like, and our fertilizer is rotting out as well, so we can. And we also have the back. big. Um, oh, I'm gonna get. In, what is it? The poo -poo pile. Yeah, yeah, fertilizer pile. Oh, uh, the fertilizer pile, that's what you meant. <laughs> we have some slang words for something, so it's like weird to find the correct words. Poo poo pile, <laughs> poo -poo yeah. Poo poo pile. That's what we call it. Because, you know, all the poo poo from the goats go there, so it is a poo poo yeah, pile. It is. It's so nice seeing this is mom. Oh, yeah, she this. joined yeah. A bit late there, a bit late. Uh, we'll be Desi going to see her soon. Uh, she's coming in summer. So. My mom is coming summer together with my brother that I haven't seen for three years. Yeah. And I think he was, how old was he? Oh, he's 16. So he was he like was a little boy when I left him. And 13? now he's, he was 13. Now he is going to turn 16. Yeah. So he was a little boy when I left him. And now he's like a full on teenager. So it's going to be weird seeing him again. And then I'm actually also going to go to Greece in September. I'm going to yeah. bring my brother back and stay there for like a, two weeks, I think. So yeah, so you're going to have lots of holidays. I'll have to take lots care of the animals. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's going to be milking as well, I forgot. So you have to do milking on Fruit trees with edible scrubs is permaculture. Okay. It's a lot more detailed, but it's worth exploring. Okay. All right. Evie, you don't look fancy. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, it's um, starting your own farm and moving to, you know, countryside is 100% doable. It's just 
the financial part is getting worse and worse every year, especially with the economy being so mm, bad. Um, it's very, very difficult to even start your own farm or to invest in it, like invest in the properties. It's really difficult. So, yeah, it's <laughs> been, been a real adventure, but you have learned a lot. You can fix it. By the way, Mike is not a human, he's my cat. So in case people are worrying why the <laughs> cat is vomiting in the room, it's like our, our other cat. We had current, we originally had three, but we took Evie because Evie is the oldest one. So she is doing her pension life here. And yeah. uh, then we left Mikey, the boy, and my father now has Nelly. Yeah. Our young girl we that found we found her, together. Yeah. The tractor has been a real adventure. The tractor has been a massive adventure, but it's working fully. Yeah. So. Tractor has been a, a fight, but um, it was worth fighting because now we learn pretty much everything about tractors. So I also crazy. like if you ask me anything, I think I know a lot of things about it. <laughs> oh, that's my brother. Yeah, it's your brother commenting as well. Yeah, I could list. I didn't see. When you do you feed? What do you feed your chickens? We have the mix that it has corn and everything inside. The, um, I don't know what it's called exactly in English. But it's a mix with everything inside. It's like um, corn with grain, not grains, but it's yeah, kind grains, of like a mix everything of... kind of mixed in. It's the yeah. best food for chickens that they sell here. It's cheap, so it's uh, affordable. Tractor turned out turned out great. Yeah, tractor is oh. working so good. I can't. So now that we're talking about tractor, our plan is to paint it green. Green. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Green with red wheels, like the inside of the. Yeah, red, the dark, dark, dark red, red wheels. Same like as the, the same. Same as the, as the cabin. Yeah, the the, the roof. <laughs> now we need to redo all the cabin, the lights, uh, hydraulics, mm -hmm. all the pipes, cables. But it's working, and. Yeah, the engine runs good. <laughs> yeah, and it have... actually runs better than the blue one. That's what we were oh, saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're Mine's saying better. in one of the past videos, because uh, we have been uploading our videos also on Facebook. So if there's some people seeing them, it's the same videos. Just like we have been very behind, and we actually yeah. saw a video from summer from the blue tractor before it broke down. And it sounds very bad now that we know how that. Yeah, you know, yeah, no, the, the blue one was working really badly. We were just not sure exactly how it needs to sound. Yeah, we're like, yeah, it's working. It was knocking. It had a metallic sound, and the videos you can even hear it really obvious that yeah. it's it's just complete different noise than what it should be. Could you order from Amazon? What about wish list? Yours conspirative. The wish list is a a thing that we have discussed. It's just. Problem with the wish list is that nothing really from Amazon is delivered here, or you know we can't select things and ship them. Only certain items are shipped and with expensive shipping, so it's really not worth it um, financially. And also, I really don't know what I wish for, so <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, I have no idea. It's like so many tools I need, but it's like yeah, when we, I need it. When like, I would need, we yeah. don't know until we do a specific project that we need it. Yeah, it's like so. the other day we needed the planer working, but the planer like you complain a lot of times that you don't have like good quality keys. But then when we go shopping, you never buy spanners, those spanners. Yeah. Yes, you, then you don't buy those. Yeah, I'm always like, ah, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. And then when it comes to do a job, he's so pissed. Yeah, there are. He not... like his mood is ruined because he doesn't find the correct size or the. No, the size thing. is not accurate. It's accurate, completely yes. Slipping. And then he's always complaining. But That's then when a... we go to the store, no more. Yeah. <laughs> What's your next piece of equipment? You guys thinking to add to the farm? Um, a digger, maybe. <laughs> maybe a digger, but uh, I don't know. It's don't, uh, don't get excited. It's not gonna be a new one. It's gonna be one that looks exactly like the green tractor. Yeah, it's a very, but a very old. But we don't know digger. because it's we don't know if it's working or anything. We have seen it, but we haven't tried it, and yeah. we we have to go try yeah. it. But the price is so low that you can't really say no. It's so, so cheap you could just buy it and sell yes, it. Yes, but I'm not buying something again that we need to mess around forever. No, no, it's, <laughs> it has to be working. We're not yes. buying another broken one, for sure. We're yes, done with broken. We're done broken things. Like, I need to set the limits, I think. Someone has commented that before that, you know, you're buying a lot of things. Have but you, thought, have you thought about building the farm? Uh, building a farm. <laughs> I read another <laughs> sentence. Uh, building a sauna. A sauna we're building, for sure. That looked like a sauna, yes. which we built, a chicken house. Yes, chicken house. Uh, but we did it with old scrap wood, so I would not like that to be my sauna. We yeah. bought that from a farm. So that's a farming use only wood. Yeah, it was a thing from a barn taken down from ferrets. Yeah, so like a ferret farm. we don't want to use that for no. our usage. It's more for birds and that. It's no problem. But it looks so good. If it's it looks here. really good. The chicken house, I'm very proud. It's one of the best designs. Yeah. If When you'll see it with the doors installed yes. and with the tops done, the you know the little holes that were still empty, like not finished, it just looks so good. But I, I'm very happy to give it to birds. 
and they need it we need it well. for them because it's a mess now it's a too tiny of a room to get in and it's annoying but sauna we will definitely do we'll do one day we're as running the problem is that we're running out of space in our land like i don't know where to put things anymore <laughs> um so so <laughs> where is the black and white cat stay uh try he... to read comments <laughs> the there. black and white cat stays in the barn sleeps in the hay roll he, he has, has a bed in the workshop and he has the hay roll barn and, and the goats yeah it stays at the goats most of the times i see him at the hay roll he um he is there. only an outside cat he does not like being inside he feels trapped he panics runs through windows doors yes, and he also will mark anything and like... he pee pees on everything he peed he, uh, he pooped in his bed he pooped in his bed, first of all, and he peed on anything I put brand new in the barn and the anything workshop. Anything brand new. I need to close up the workshop. I can't let him in there. He's okay in the barn, but in the in workshop. In the goat barn, yeah. He pees on things. That's why we could to. never put him inside. First of all, as David said, he also feels panic and trapped. And he's a cat. It's a male that he will go in and out. Not in and out, but he will leave for a longer period of time. Then he'll come back. He's like, you never know when he's here, like when he yeah. stays here. And like his whole life has been living outside. Yeah, yeah, he's just not around. used to living in a house. No, he doesn't know it, so it's like hard to teach him that. The mudroom is gonna be definitely done this um, this Some spring. Spring somewhere. Then. S- probably spring. We'll start it straight away, and we have another plan here for. Uh, have we said it? For a dining area, which is gonna be same where, as the mudroom. Where? Like here, where this window is. It's okay. gonna be a room. Yeah, you can uh, see the table. Room, like, um, like for dining, know, an yeah. outside one. The window becomes a doorway. Like, I don't know if you've seen those, like, circle ones, Circle, like extensions. Yeah. It's, it's going to have the same uh, stone uh, foundation and, uh, well, same building, kind of. Yeah. And then from upstairs, it's going to be a balcony, so you can walk Maybe. on it and, yeah, of course, yeah, I mean. So, I don't know. Or if it's there. Like a Rapunzel. <laughs> <laughs> if, it's all, if it's there already, you can just make I a guess. door and walk on it, so. Yeah, um, for no reason. Is your mom going to move in with you? That's her decision. That's her decision. We're not pressuring her. her. <laughs> <laughs> um, anything we missed? Raised beds look great. Yeah, raised beds are fun, but for us, it's easier just to plow a field. But For a big things overall, yes. Yeah. But uh, we're going to get some more raised beds Cause, probably. Because we also want to plant a lot because we have the animals. We have like the goats can eat so many pumpkins. Like, we can plant way more than a normal person will be planting for the family because we pretty much nothing goes to waste like chickens, pupils. Goats will eat anything that we overplant or overproduce, but it hasn't been the case. So. Yeah, the German, the German Shepherd, we actually, not like we have adopted it, but he's pretty much just lives here more than he does at his own place. He is here when we're outside. When we're not outside, he's home. Yeah, he's home. He's guarding his own place, but he guards this place as his, so it's good as a guard dog for us, yeah. um, pretty much. And uh, but he's hard to t- teach. He's pretty much impossible to teach. And yeah. he commands. We have trained Keita in less than a year. We have trained her. She actually caught one of the chickens. I don't know if I've said it in any video. Yeah, but... she was trying to catch chickens. Yeah, she actually as an had it. Away. Yeah, as an insect, because she is a hunter's dog, and she's been living wild for a while. Yeah. So she caught it, the brown chicken from the tail, and we screamed at her pretty bad, and. You know, slapped her nose and tell her not to do it. And since then, she has not even tried. Yeah. She do, she's looking at the chickens, but like going away. No, she's very she's intelligent. She's very intelligent. She's she's no problem learning. She she learns commands like wait, and then she can take the food. Everything like, you can teach her. I would never her. expect that for a ten year old dog to be able to tell her like to put the food down and tell her to yeah. wait, and then give her the command to go. The going command is not working the yeah. best <laughs> because what she's still waiting. Miss? Uh, basement is a lot of work we mentioned it large shift tower in some videos we wanted to go there today actually but there's a snowstorm on that side so we yeah, didn't end up going today. yeah it was a full snowstorm so it's just like no point in risking it because snow is going to melt soon so we can go it actually melted already but yeah. because it's higher up we didn't want to risk it yeah there's a lot colder it's more north so we don't just yeah. want to risk it no so to, to slide off the road or get stuck, it's just pointless if we can go on a sunny day. Yeah, because the snow is over. So um, do you get many deer? We have a lot of deer and there are too many deer some places. Some fields just get, you know, destroyed by deer. They used to come very close, but now we have the electric fence for the goats, yeah. so they don't come in our field. Yeah, they were actually, they destroyed last spring, they destroyed most of our and berry when- bushes. Oh yeah, the and first uh, year we trees as well. They destroy the bucks mostly. Do that. They scratch them between. Yeah, the um, and they fight it uh, on the, the mating bush, yeah. time. They fight the, um, the bush. Sticks. <laughs> yeah, the bush, anything, and they destroy it fully. They kill it. So now we're lucky. Now we have electric fence pretty much fully around our property, so we're protected from foxes and deer. 
Yeah, foxes. And that's I pretty guess. much all our wildlife. And I guess badgers we have as well. And mm, not really. We saw one running on the road. <laughs> yes, <laughs> in <laughs> summer. <laughs> it was like running, like so funny how they run. But uh, yeah, we have some badgers. I mean, badgers can take chickens. I think maybe I don't know. I haven't oh, heard nice. about it. And the ferrets, but ah, yeah, don't do it's, it in the day. it's crazy how much we have achieved in three years. It's yeah. We actually wanted to make a three-year video, like what we have done in three years, but then we decided we're going to split it in sections of like what we have built, what we have destroyed, what we have our story with Homestead. So I think those are more interesting videos, just have like um, separate videos for every single yeah. thing instead of making one big video and then repeating ourselves. So Yeah, and uh, what was this one? Uh, I saw it. Uh, yeah, we're going to plant tr the new trees and different plants in your garden. Your cute garden. Um, probably we're we're always Which looking for unique garden? anything. Oh. I think secret garden. I want to make. <clears throat> if you have seen the um, more house roses, video, I want to do the whole around the house. I want to put flowers. Flowers. So we're looking for things. Pots. Yeah, I have a hanging pots to take. We need things that grow in darkness because it's not so bright there in summer. It gets darkness. all like shadow. <laughs> shadow. Yeah, it gets all shadow. So we need things there, and we need want more berries, more unique trees, more. More nut trees. We we have a walnut, but uh, it hasn't given us a single nut yet, and it's like very old tree, so I don't know how long it takes. Um, and more basement we keep probably not. It's all junk mostly. It's, we kept. I don't know. What I don't think we're actually keeping anything. Like oh, we we need. Oh yeah, that. and actually, a lot of people like <laughs> thought that the teapot is a keeper. It is cute. <laughs> But it's broken. It was not, I don't know, it was The full probably, side was broken the off. The full side was broken off, so you wouldn't be able to use it for anything practical. And I don't think I would I mean, use I, it for It looks cool for a flower, to plant in a flower. So we we're thinking to take it like where it's broken and just plant something in that. Yeah, put a pl flower in. That's what because I was Because it's saying. broken. <laughs> Are you protecting your house by growing landscape away from the house? Your water table height. Water is pretty low. Like next to the house is pretty much like a few meters under. I mean, the basement, as you can see, has a problem with water. But it's but, only... But that's lack of maintenance as well, that no one maintained the walls. So they're just moisture coming through. Um, oh, thank you for the thank donation. Thank you so much. It's a lot, Jesus. <laughs> thank, thank you so you, much. Gail. Um, okay, thank you. And... Uh, actually, I have a plan of grading away the landscape around the house because it's kind of like a bump, it goes next to the house, so down, and then it goes down, and it's really annoying to walk, it's all We're slippy. We're slipping on the, in front of yeah, the Yeah, because it's all of a slope down, down. and I want to grade it out, either I bring some more dirt over, and then I want to also maybe put French drains around the house, yeah. To dr help and drain the drainage. foundation, and, and roof drainage to collect Once rainwater. The roof is done. Yeah, we need Hopefully. to first do the roof. There's yeah. so much to do, it's just, it's pretty much impossible to yeah. keep up. That's why a digger would be useful, because you, you're yes, of able you to dig anything. <laughs> I want a digger, I love digging, I don't you know. You can find so many things about your digger. Yeah, um, a lot of questions we missed. Um, what's your best way to donate, guys? Uh, we have like a PayPal for donations. Easy. If you really want to help us out, that means a lot. Uh, yeah. So many projects are just founded by people that donate. It's We don't say it every time, because it's uh, hard to keep up, and it's a lot of things are like months later. But a lot of donations have helped through the money yes. projects. Like without the donations, we would probably not do half the project. Thank like, you so much. And even just like by crazy. watching our videos, liking our videos, sharing of our videos. Watching our videos <laughs> is just enough. Um, is, is, is more than enough. Yeah. Liking, sharing, everything. Commenting it's even like, just, I don't know. Our statistics are very good. I don't know why YouTube is not sponsoring. Like not sponsoring, but like yeah, boosting us. Suggesting us. Because all the statistics are like perfect. So I don't know if anyone's listening. <laughs> Can't overwhelm my job. Intense. My brother asked what time to wake up in the morning. Nine o'clock. We no, try. Mm. Eight thirty, nine o'clock is the alarm, but we did we try. We have to decide. Summer we wake up early. Summer no. I did seven o'clock early. Yeah, but that was also feeling really good. Now in the winter, like you can't wake up. And early. there's not much to do as well. It's so cold and rainy. I mean, there's a lot of things we have to do. I guess. But <laughs> it's, I don't know, you just feel tired in winter. Yeah. Uh, so it depends. We have decided we want to wake up with the sunrise. But we'll see how that yeah. goes. <laughs> What's happening with your well? Our well is full to the top right now, but it's winter, so it would naturally be anyways. It's just ground ground level is so high, but uh, we'll see in summer. What are your hobbies when you're relaxing? Putting up a different ceiling. That's no. Not... That's your no. hobby? No, it's a oh. <laughs> the ceiling I love. I read another one. I no, I think it's like I love it, but we need to seal it better. But once we do the upstairs, no, floor, once upstairs is done, there's no like, need to seal it more. I think that's like pretty beautiful. Oh, there's well audience. <laughs> <laughs> it's our audience. 
Do you have like some onions from David's aunt growing inside? For her your or hobby is to relax at home. What's your hobbies? I don't know. David um, doesn't really have a hobby. I, I, my hobby would be to build things in the workshop, but I can't build anything without filming it. So I've yeah. been wanting to build this the uh, little two wheel thing I have. I want to build it into a tractor with steering wheel and everything. It's it's not like I need it or it's not like uh, most practical, but I just want to do yeah. something. I love building things and it's just making something from nothing is just just satisfying and interesting yeah that's one hobby but i can't do it because it needs filming then that's not really a hobby hobby it's like, more, like, it's more work, like work yeah hobby. and then i you just like playing games sometimes. play video, like, games, video games sometimes <laughs> but i should quit fully because it's just draining my energy way too no much. it's annoying you're playing some games and then they make you angry then it ruins you yeah <laughs> just... and i like knitting yeah. i do like bracelets i made this ones so i like <laughs> And what else did we do? We play board games, so it's not really a hobby. Yeah. What else do I have as a hobby? I don't know. Okay, where was that? <laughs> After Roof Agenda this summer. I don't um, log. I don't think so. I think it's the uh, internet. Okay. On the other internet. Okay. Uh, roof Agenda this summer is uh, roof, roof on this. on the. I can't speak. <laughs> roof on the agenda. Hopefully, but that's all yeah. financial. That's not um, something we can decide. Thank you so much. A Ed Editha. <laughs> Thank you so much. We didn't say doggy. last time. Who was that? Gail, I said it. Oh, you said it? Yeah. Okay, Thank attention. you so much. Oh, there it is. It came back in this phone. It's okay. a bit delayed. Are you going to plant trees? The perimeter would be environment good for the environment. Also, your your for your fire in long term. Yeah, we have our, our ditch, for example, is all growing. And it's at least five meters in the width, the ditch is. So it's going to be more than enough firewood for like in a mm -hmm. few years, of course, it's going to take 10 years. Yeah. But it will come and for wood chips as well for gardens. Yeah. It's a very we good, have a lot of wood it's a good there. recovering trees. The trees are growing there. You can cut them fully down in a year. They could be half of the size. Like when already. we arrived, it was empty. It was cut. It freshly. was all cut. Like the view you could see so far and now it's like all grown back. And we have already used a lot of wood from there. Like we're cutting consistently for goats and we're so like spreading like it out fast. so they can grow bigger and we're cutting the smaller ones out. Someone said that we should just do like do their our things and not need to film them always, just do them for enjoyment. But David always wants to film it just in case it turns out cool and for which one? No, like to do when you want to do your um tricycle motorblock. Yeah. We said not to need to film it. But we can just yeah, do it for enjoyment. It's the problem is yeah, like if, if, if it, it comes out, out really <laughs> cool and <laughs> I didn't film it, it's annoying. And it can also be successful, maybe not like it's not the best maybe for you guys, but it can be successful yeah. for actual audience that enjoys those kind of things. So in that sense, like, you know, it can pay itself back and provide me, you know, yeah. money for buying something I actually want. That's my or, kind of our channel is like pretty much everything. We all do. kinds <laughs> of places. It's pretty much like everything we do is yeah. on there. So it's it's all over the place. We're sometimes. kind of different. So we do everything. Yeah. It's a question, question to the man of the house. You ever build scale model kits? I'm not allowed <laughs> because I don't have a place to store them, apparently. What? M m scale model kits. Oh, yeah. He's not allowed because he doesn't have a place to put them and I'll have to be the one on dusting them. Yeah. So <laughs> I will I can only Once do it. Once we have upstairs. Once upstairs, is yes. apparently. So yeah. you're gonna have a big desk. We're gonna each of us have a desk with a computer, and each of us can design it the way they want it. So I can put flowers, and uh, yeah, yeah. no, you can put your cactuses. <laughs> I can put other things. You can put your models there. Just speaking tempo is so fast. We're so sorry. <laughs> yeah, we're trying to. It's say, uh, it's okay. also like most of the times we try to speak fast to get the point out, and so work, we can say more things or to work. Oh no! Currently, <laughs> I just want to say one thing fast and then get to the next. Yeah, because we're thing. behind your comments <laughs> so far. We're trying to read them. And then we over explain things, so we're gonna just say it simple for some reason. What do you knit, Desi? What do I knit? I have knitted hats. Actually, only hats. <laughs> I have knitted pants. If you sign the summer, I can bring them. Wait, I'll show you. You're gonna bring it? Yeah. Okay, I'll, I'll read the next I'm time. Very proud about it. The skull we found. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> it would look cool as an ornament. Thank you for everyone. Oh, that's, uh, it's your mom watching a bit of delay for my car. But my cat is very interested in this. <laughs> so, so if you saw last summer's video, pants. I was knitting something blue and they don't really look blue, but they're like baby blue. And those are summer pants. So that's what I was knitting. Actually, my mom did all the hard parts and I was just knitting straight lines. And my mom now in winter, she helped me to put the top on. So that really? was my biggest project. But other than that, I have knitted three hats. And the gray full face hat. And I have knitted one half sock. 
It's not even half. I said one, one ha- uh, half, half. <laughs> half a sock I've knitted. Because I got to the difficult part. I mean, I actually got over the difficult part. You started, like David but... started knitting. Instead of knitting something easy, he went straight for my knitting a sock. I mean, socks are useful. I didn't need anything else. A hat. Hmm. It's also pretty easy. Uh, wait, I had, there was a question. Okay. Solar panels are helping out with efficiency. 100%. Every time sun shines, everything in the house is for free. Uh, electricity wise, we boost like more things like we put, like, yeah, dishwasher you can go shower, uh, water will heat up for free. We put a dishwasher that's, that's for free. <laughs> it's, I don't know, it fell lower. <laughs> so, the solar panels, I think, ne- like next upcoming months when the sun is pretty much most of the time out, is gonna be very good. And we need to install batteries, uh, anyways. Next, uh, need a man cave, yes, I do 100%. I need a man cave. You will have an li- actual man cave. Yes. Make you a cave. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Are you planning to expand your family soon? Yes, hopefully. What? Um, pl- expanding your family. Expanding. Expa- <laughs> Thank you, Liz, so much. Thank it's you so on much. The screen because we're so delayed. <laughs> Thank, you, Thank so you so much, much for the donation. Love your hard work. Amazing. Thank you. And I'm again so like amazed how there's people from all over the world. That yeah, is, we like, have pretty amazing. viewers from everywhere. Wait. Okay. Let's okay, answer okay. the questions. Okay. Need a man cave again. I need a man cave. It's just a suggestion that I need a man cave. We just need a bigger house, I think. No? Add That's more what extensions. I said. Add more extensions. Yeah, we actually, we just like the more extensions, the better. <laughs> we, have, uh, we have no limit with extensions. Uh, okay, okay. I love the music you put on videos. Thank okay. you. That's Despina's work, not um, mine. Most I, of the I, I did the last video, Sam. Sam. But you went through with my life. No, you went through my favorites on the playlist. Yeah. Uh, it seems like. You are always working, and uh, I can tell you enjoy it. But please relax. Just, now we're relaxing. I I pretty much would say I broke my back doing the basement. Yeah. It um because it's like you are throwing with the shovel and you twisting consistently and for hundreds of times for we we work like for nine hours tons. maybe. I think you did two tons. Two tons in a day like maybe of there. Like this all the time. Uh, by checking off the tires and uh, and you know seeing the pile, it was a lot of weight. And yeah. doing doing that fully in one day was ridiculous. Like it was two different videos you saw. But it was in one day we did ripping out the floors no, and was, and then the next day uh, and then it was another day yeah we didn't do so it, it was full day. okay so it was two days but still it was too much and i had back pain for two three days and i didn't have it that long anything about sand batteries yeah sand batteries sound amazing for um keeping heat in your stove but it's um it takes space and uh, a lot of sand well sand is cheap in latvia actually but yeah we'll see <laughs> for now we're just planning central heating that would be the best did you see any... Oh, okay, reading the same questions. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, is that true that you never fight or do you keep it out of public? Of course, we keep it out of public. We don't <laughs> upload our fights. Uh, there's in the videos, sometimes there's some fights that have been cut off, but not like fight, fight, like no. very young. It's more like when we're tired, we argue, but... Yeah, it's just like over dumb things as well. Yeah. It's not the most... But uh, no, we don't really, we don't do big fights. We kind of understand each other, that yeah. each have a different opinion on and things. S- and sometimes when we do have fights, is not, not, I don't want to call not fights, fights, arguments no. more or less. It's, yeah, it's arguments like, oh, okay, we don't agree on the same thing. But we find but the rarely, best solution most but cases. Rarely. Very rare, yeah. No. We most we agree on many we things. We keep away from fights. Yeah. <laughs> but at the end of the day, we're like happy again. And like, we never go mad in the bed. <sighs> Are you planning on adding any more? And what's the farm? Yes, one more ducks. That's it. Ducks? Oh, and then llamas. We saw some zebras. There was camels for sale, I, actually. I would like alpacas. There was camels for sale. What do you think about camels? Camels? Yeah, there was Where? two camels for sale. In Riga. The boy? Yeah. Well, that's what he does. That's what he does. He sees the animals and then he's like, I cannot say no. I'm not joking. Camels. Imagine camels. This is a cool Another animal. animal to shave. Shave? No, you don't shave camels. How do I mean, you can shave here? anyone, but... <laughs> How do they stay here? I, I don't think so. I don't think they have wool. They have a desert animal. Yeah, but why are they not? I don't know. There's, there's camels. So, yeah, only ducks, I think. We're not going big with cows. Alpacas? And... Yeah, I guess, but we need more land. Alpacas. We're actually thinking to move the sheep. The sheep are moving maybe away. Not our two. Our sheep will stay. But the but... babies will. We are thinking on expanding on David's aunt's. Field. Yeah, because she has a lot of land and, and we could put some sheep there. They want to get rid of the cows because they're too big yeah. and too much work. So But we can put sheep yeah. there. And my uncle said he'll be a shepherd every any <laughs> any day of the week. So to be honest, the sheep have been the the sheep have been the easiest animal to take care of lately. Like the past they have eaten zero months. hay. 
in the I winter. I think they do. When they they eat some, night. probably, but... I don't see them. They're not like after it like goats. No. They, they are just on the field eating. Um, I give them sticks to eat, like, you know, eat the yeah. skin off. But they do not care about hay, about water, about anything. There's just no effort, um, except the boys. Uh, oh. The big... Um, Marulis. <laughs> Marulis, yeah. What is, a, what is a boy sheep in? Sheep boy, I don't know. Um, black pack is a goat. No. What was it? I forgot. Sheep uh, boy. <laughs> yeah, anyways. He eats hay non-stop. He loves hay yeah. and drinks water non-stop. Fights for the water. Yeah. Um. So those but guys, those yeah. two ladies over but there. But the ladies don't care. Okay, Haven't there's so much them. comments. Okay. We're probably so behind. <laughs> We're over-explaining the sheep. Yes. <laughs> um... Get a pet pig. Get know. a donkey. Donkeys scream a lot and they get rid of uh, foxes. Yeah, but they also scream a lot. <laughs> we do want to... Listen, our plan is... The gold pan currently... You see how the two windows are? We're thinking to put horses in there. I've said it before. Horses? Horses. One horse ah, for me, one horse for, yeah, for me. Yeah, and, and the goat barn, as you see it, it can be expand indefinitely. So we can expand it longer. <laughs> We're just like expanding everything. <laughs> we don't have space, build more. Yeah, just no, add more know. extensions. I would love horses. Get pigs, yeah, pigs are cool. And just like extra jobs <laughs> for us. Uh, but to be honest, animals don't take so much effort. No, they take animals. us one hour max a day to feed them and in and out, what, like whatever each animal requires. <laughs> are you working? Where are you? Because I don't know what you're doing. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you do me that last, so I know where you are. When are we going to buy a 300 horsepower Western tractor? Oh, when the when we w- hit a jackpot or something. like When we get 1 million subscribers. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, good. 300 horsepower, that would be overdone, but I wouldn't mind. I, it's bigger the number, the better. <laughs> um, that would be cool. Yeah, just something like John Deere or something, Matthew Ferguson. Uh, it, it, don't make me dream. There's a lot <laughs> I can dream about. Camels are hard. Yeah. Are they? I don't know. I guess. I mean, I would expect, yeah. It's not an easy animal. Ram, works, I guess, yeah. He works so hard. Are you planning on taking a holiday? I don't know if uh, my mom is listening. Yeah, it's all about Destin's <laughs> mom. No, uh, it's not about her. It's all about her, because <laughs> she's the only contact we have that could no, take care of. No, listen. I wouldn't things. mind... I wouldn't mind getting a farm hunt. Yeah, right? farm hunt. For the animals hard. outside. I don't want to give her that responsibility. But I have Evie and Kate are currently, like so like close to me that i don't trust pretty much anyone i guess except yeah. of my mom it's too much stress to take them anywhere either oh like, no you, you cannot take them with, with them you and... no that's pointless so if my mom would stay here with a person that wouldn't be bad <laughs> you know farm. with a farm hunt yeah, maybe in the future we'll see but um, yeah we're planning maybe on taking some holidays in summer like for like a few days yeah the animals I mean, don't yeah. require so much work then so yeah maybe Big bill for a horse, definitely. Oh, I mean, yeah, it's hay, but horses don't require just hay. They also re- need oats and lots of other things. And I also to buy a is. horse is expensive. Horses it's are expensive. Start with that. Like, it's yeah. cheaper to buy a car. <laughs> uh, I grew up on a farm, that's when I grew up in the city. And we did not meet in the school. No. That would be cool. <laughs> that would that be cool? No, I don't think so. Don't no, think. How would that be cool? Like, then we would never come to Latvia. Yeah, probably. Yeah. <laughs> then school. we'd be in the same country, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. No, we um, met online, not the romant- most romantic way yeah. at all. When the stars come back, they should be coming back now. The guy. One. The, the guy. Only the guy comes back early. We have to check the nest for the GoPro. We have to go upstairs because maybe our camera, we lost our camera in summer, and it the might GoPro, be yeah. in the stork nest. Because he has an intention of stealing things. Yes, they he has stolen, stolen gloves. two or three gloves of me. Yeah. Something like that. Then is he stole socks. Socks, yeah. He has taken things that fall on the ground. Just storks love it. I never get tired. Are you hyperactive? <laughs> I don't know how. Help me. <laughs> oh, you're very kind. Very Just want our videos and your Yeah, it's okay. Don't them. worry. Uh, I don't know if I'm hyperactive. I, sometimes I get, if I get into something, like if I get into cleaning the house, I'll, I have to finish <laughs> cleaning it and I have to clean yeah. it perfectly. It's just, it's just something about it. Um, we same have thing days. with most jobs. We just need to finish it. But then there's days, yeah, we just Where don't we do feel nothing like and the house looks a mess. So yeah, yeah. there's days where... We are like very motivated. It's also that you are only seeing like the side that we are working, we're like productive and everything. It's like many lazy days, the same as normal people. Yeah, that's what I was thinking a few days ago. Like people like complain, not complaining, but like being worried about us working so much and yeah. not relaxing. I mean, so, we do take, we, our working days are longer just because we stay up so late for editing the videos, uploading yeah. and everything. It's no, like the, day, have... the work doesn't stop since you go in from the work. You still yeah. have to keep working on other things. 
and then you have to take care of your house and everything else. Yes, that's where sometimes the house is a mess. Yeah, it's just... But it's okay. Yeah. Good to have dishwashers and yeah, a cleaning washing, lady. Washing. And... Yeah, we have... We have a cleaning lady over there. Yeah. I was not a fan of it. But David... I, I need to cut that onion. It's annoying me. Yeah, eat it. It's the best... Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's the best thing. Just yeah. not needing to go clean the... We have vac like vacuum cleaning. She's yeah. like you. She just does her thing. One or two hours a day. Yeah, she, she, just, she just... I was not the, the biggest fan about it because... But then we had to always keep the house at least the floor clean, and I didn't know how she's gonna like it here. She is pretty wrecked though on the top, like she is bumping yeah. the brick walls. But it's okay. I don't think these little robots <laughs> are made for brick walls. No, she and looks like a shield. There's so many things that she's scratching herself on. We have like the legs of the wood stove is pretty sharp. No, that's Anything. not the biggest problem. The biggest problem is that she does edges of the walls. Like if you and have she one tries of those to climb robots, them as well. yeah, she's trying to get in the bedrooms. And then I don't know if you have one of those robots, but they're like once it's finished the room, she doesn't go all around the house. She goes the edges, edges yeah. and she scratches herself on the brick walls. That's yeah, a problem. and she wants to clean it so well. Yeah, so and badly. <laughs> she's like hyperactive about cleaning. And uh, Desmond has been to America. We deserve yeah, a yes. holiday. Uh, <laughs> I would love one. Well, that's random. Does it fit together? Building. Pole barn. Pole barn. We actually are thinking about building. Which it's what? pole barn. It's like the big giant barns for mm -hmm. you can store hay rolls. You can oh, okay, tractors. yeah, that's how they're called again, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's just... I don't know the proper... put them on poles, uh, that's why. Oh, I don't know the proper... It's a very... Terms. I have it planned as a very big barn. It's going to go on the... Tr like, a little. we have a little triangle that no one uses. Like, we don't use it very much. We had their goats on there. Mm -hmm. But it's a very bad land because it doesn't have good hay. Oops. And it's the, the end, the triangle we have, the little corner. Where, Where the, the goats were. Where the goats were. We're in front of the rolls, hay rolls. Lost. That's, ah, yay, yay, yay. that's gonna be a big barn there. Okay, gotcha. And we're gonna do a yard there and barn. It's far from the house, so it doesn't look bad. And you're gonna see it from the house. And you don't see it from the house. And it's gonna look amazing. So, but it's expensive. <laughs> Wood is very expensive. And yeah, that's about it. Yeah, the problem is we wanna build so many things. And it's and a lot of work, of we, course. Like, and it's not only financial, it's like, where, what do we prioritize as well? Yeah. Like, where do we get started? Like, of course, we the, now the animals, I'm happy at least all the animals have a house, have a shelter. They're like all fine for like many years. And uh, so that is done. Yeah, That's animals, we're not animals getting have more. their houses. Um, but we do need a, a storage place for all the machines. Yeah. Even for a car, we yeah, need but a garage need, kind of place. The question is, do we need that before we need to finish the bottom floor of the house? Yeah, like, priorities are hard, you know. to, hard to put. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's very hard to prioritize. Or do we want to first do the roof or do we want to first put the machine under the roof? Probably put the machinery under its own roof and then fix our yeah. roof because our roof. The thing is, with roof. our house, once you start the roof, you need to have all the material to change the roof. You need to have extra money in case things are completely, yeah. you know, different than what you expect. And um, then you need all the money to renovate the upstairs. Of course, that doesn't need to be straight away, but it comes with it. You know, you want to move in up there, and it's a lot. <sighs> Have you ever seen YouTube channels, My Self Reliance? I think mm -hmm. so. Yeah, I don't know. I think so. I think so many different ones. And <laughs> I think I think we're self sufficient. Me, that's the one I I saw recently. I was watching him about talking about chickens, but that's a you see, Australian channel. Someone said that you need a man cave, and I need one too. I want to have like a very big, not a very big room, but like <laughs> in the storage room. I want to put like um, a table for like sewing and doing crafts. Like I want like a big table for sewing and doing those kind of things. So I think that's good enough for me. Yeah. Because it's annoying to bring a sewing machine in the middle of the room and then you always, my mom knows that pain. You always have to put it up and then you have to take it away. If you cannot leave a project yeah. not finished and it's just so annoying. And you need a whole desk here. We have a computer, yeah. so you can't do it. The eating table, you know, you want to eat you food, eat food, so, so you, you need to take that. it away. So yeah, it's gonna be in the storage room. Hopefully. We're gonna put a giant counter, and it's gonna be a washing machine underneath, mm -hmm. and sink. some drawers maybe, and it's gonna have a sink that we can close up. Yeah. Uh, the storage room. I can't wait Dude, to have floor. <laughs> when it's floor, then it's just easy. Oh yeah. Well, then it's uh, already furniture. done. Furniture. It's just furniture. That's yeah. like the easy part. The hardest part about storage room is to finish the basement to yeah. seal it from water. I think the water is gonna be our enemy. I don't matter what mm. you do. Turn the clock back. On similar adventure, yeah, it's. It, I'm I'm really grateful for what we are doing and. Yeah. For Sometimes the, it's hard. It's yeah. Well, I must say. You think, oh, so hard and difficult. And but everything. then you are like you're grateful for it. Yeah. Like I had a phase like a week ago where I was like everything was wrong. I was feeling so like I think everyone goes to phase with just 
not everyone shows those. It's like everyone has their ups and downs and we also go through those. And I'm more like emotional, more like I was very low and I was not motivated to do anything. But uh, yeah, where was I going with it? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I mean... It is hard. Yeah. And I was thinking like, would it be easier to go nine to five job? Because then you come home and then you have nothing to do. But then you don't have also the part to like, or the motivation to do the things we're doing. Because if we didn't have to film them and if we didn't have to finish projects and do them nice and do them proper, like the past year, two, two years. So yeah, it's, I think it's much better. Like I, I appreciate what we're doing and I really love yeah, what we're doing. What else? Sorry, I'm putting the link. Oh. <laughs> People asking for the link to donate. Hey, it doesn't appear. I love my necklace is actually um, amber, I think it's called, right? Zinters is in Latin. Amber. Yeah, amber. It's amber. It's like the local, not local, like the gem of the country. <laughs> um, Why I lost it? I think it went in. I don't know if it's oh, clickable, though. It is. It went in. It's blue, so it should be clickable. No? Oh, I'm trying to pin it. It don't let me anything. It's okay, it's yellow. I was like, no, it's oh, gonna it's... disappear, that's why. But oh. uh yeah, sorry, I'm trying to put it. Okay, you can ask us more questions because we need yeah. questions. <laughs> when are you starting building a baby nursery? Uh when the time is right. Yeah. We actually might have to change some plans, we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> we have to, yeah, I mean. Time is flying. Yeah. Time literally flies. Like it's been three years. It's hard to realize it's been three it years, feels but it like feels like it's more. It feels like it has been six years, but then it also feels like where has time gone? But then if we think what we have done, it just I don't know. It's a weird feeling. Yeah. Like now it currently feels like it's David's birthday because David's birthday was in January, so it feels like like it's coming up. Not that it was. Yeah. I know. <laughs> How do you feel you're one month, uh, 26? 26 years old? I don't know. <laughs> Mid-20s, early 20s, I don't know. I'm still early 20s. I think your mom tried to put it, but... Uh... Have you met my mom a moderator? Yeah, she's a moderator, <laughs> actually, yeah. She has a... Her I'm own right. name is highlighted. Yeah. And everything. She's a proper, proper employee. Someone said it's working. It's working. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> okay. Um, any other questions, guys? What type of questions do you have? I'm most excited mm -hmm. to grow in your garden this year. Corn? Uh, anything. Just like, just As succeed. long as anything <laughs> succeeds. Anything you plant that succeeds is happiness. Yes. Because... Uh, for us. Of course, was... for any gardener is like, huh? Because no, of it's course easy. it's happiness for everyone that if it's something good. <laughs> no, but it's, it seems easy for those who know how to do it. But it's hard when but you But they still it. appreciate it and they're happy about it. I think it. the biggest problem for us is we don't spend enough time in the gardens. Yeah. We just have no time. I think that's, that's the biggest say, problem. That's what say, but... But um, no, I, I want to grow corn. Yeah. Watermelons. Yeah, can we actually do watermelons? Like we tried like we did years now. have one grown, I think, but not enough to be even Mostly eatable. Plant size. Yeah, because we planted That's them. It's not a late. watermelon. And, so yeah, uh, like anything. If anything succeeds, I will be happy. Okay. Any other questions? What do you use most from your garden? Potatoes. <laughs> the only thing. Potatoes. <laughs> Is the most useful thing you can ever plant and the best thing because it lasts for months. You can ha you'll have it pretty much till next mm, next potatoes, maybe not, but till start until of the, summer. Until the, you can take new potatoes out of the ground. Like Nearly, so yeah, they'll potatoes. be starting to you know get soggy. But if you have a good um, if you have a good basement, a good solid basement will keep your potatoes fresh yeah. pretty much. You know, I mean, even our potatoes now they're not really that bad. No, Sitting I mean the now they're good because now it's not the season for them to start growing. So uh, I guess. And what else? Nothing. Just potatoes? That's how bad we are. Yeah, I mean potatoes. What else do we have? Well, apples. Those apples. Not our apples. That's from my aunt. We have apples. Because ours are all non not They're non winter apples. They're not staying over they the don't, winter. They don't stay over winter. Yeah. Uh, what else? What are you reading? Nothing. Okay. Carrots. <laughs> they store well. Yes, carrots. Carrots. Any First, root, any root vegetable stays well. Yeah, second year. But uh, we just didn't succeed on growing them because we um, didn't take care of them. No. You know, the problem was that... We and I cultivated not... them yeah. as well. That we, was thought, we thought David got pissed because we thought they didn't come out. And then he got angry and he was like, mm, I'm just going to cultivate the whole land again and plant new. And then we realized that there was carrots that are growing. <laughs> yeah, we did harvest some. What? Like, mm, like a yeah. 
hundred grams. Like, like, <laughs> it was it was a really dry summer again, and uh, but everyone else succeeds around us. Yeah, because they kept watering it, and we just didn't have the time. Mm, I guess raspberries. Birgit's favorite is raspberries. Yeah, and last year they we didn't last have last year was no raspberries because they froze. The flowers froze. Like yeah. we had a very this, warm. This year might be pretty bad as well because there are already leaves are starting to come out now, and it's yeah. February, and uh, that's not good because things start way too, way too early and they freeze, and that just messes things up. I think. I don't know. I'm not an expert. <laughs> no, but last year we had a very early spring and then it froze. So it froze our cherries and raspberries. All planting. Yeah. I don't know part. what trees we're planting. Like um, fast growing trees. I, mean, I, don't know. I saw in uh, Asia somewhere was those fa oh, super fast growing trees. The ones actually for yeah. like the windmills? No, that was not Asia. Where was that? It was somewhere Asia. Yeah? Yeah. I remember. Sri Lanka or something, I don't know. No. But those were super fast. Ten years, they're getting giant. Was it the South, South Africa? I don't remember. I don't remember. But uh, yeah, there is fast growing trees, but I don't know if they grow in our climate, really. Mm -mm. It's a bit more different climate. I think, yeah, I don't remember. Really. Yeah, you can look for the name. I don't remember how they're called. <laughs> onions. Oh, yeah, onions is one of Oh, the yeah, good onions ones. and garlics. Onions yeah. and garlics is a really good one. They know one. more than we do. <laughs> yeah, those ones stay good. <laughs> yeah. We're still eating our onions. Well, yeah. ours slash ours, my ours. as well. Oh, no, we finished our aunt ones. Ah, okay. Then we're eating our ours. Very small, but still good. Yeah. And, and garlic. Gar garlic we have a lot. Oof, we love garlic. Garlic, more we have garlic. to plant more. Cold frame. I don't know what's a cold frame. You can buy fabric cloth to protect things over oh, winter. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, not the... I want to buy the... It's the white fabric. Another the problem we had was the butterflies. Apparently, the, the our, worms... Yeah, the green worms. They ate our cabbages. Cabbages. And cauliflowers. Cauliflowers. And, salads. Mm -hmm. Salads? Radish, radishes, radishes, they ate, leaves they ate, um, rucula, I think it's called. Rucula they ate as well. So yeah, I want to buy those, uh, this fabric, the net kind of that, you know, still lets light in, but um, yeah, protects from, you know, anything. If we're going to try it. beekeeping. Uh, our neighbors are doing beekeeping. They're kind of stopping because uh, he's getting yeah, you too need old. To learn it. But I need to take it over from him. He has maybe like 40, 50 beehives. So I could take some beehives. I don't, I don't know. even need to buy some. I don't know. That's how many he has actually. Yes. Active? Active has Act like 10. Yeah, maybe. that's what I mean. It's just I'm saying that's how much he has. Like you could possibly have a whole empire yeah. of these. Because they're already here, so they don't need to move. <laughs> yeah, and he doesn't he doesn't need them anymore. Yeah. So So we need to like maybe from this year on, maybe you need to be with him when he does it. So we learn so we can take over some. What's our uh, typical breakfast and uh our breakfast? Typical Latvian recipes. Well, our breakfast is not typical Latvian. <laughs> our typical breakfast mostly. That, I I like I I like salty breakfast. That's been like sweet breakfast. I have a problem. I have to have a sweet breakfast, or you know, I can eat salty like I can eat a bit of a sweet breakfast, but I'm not like also the biggest breakfast one. I know it's bad. Breakfast mm. is the most important, but it's hard. So I can have like something sweet. Like if I wake up at nine, let's say. I'll have something sweet and then I'll get hungry at 11. So I'll eat something salty then. <laughs> so it's very messed up. <laughs> but um, yeah, you could eat very big breakfast. What is your favorite surprise from running your own farm? Surprise. And is it as fulfilling as you hope to be? I, I'd say farming definitely is fulfilling. Yeah. And you're not going to know it until you do it. Um, it's... I don't know, it's a lot of happiness that you get just from these small things. Like, it's crazy. very small things. Even, like, accomplishments or something. Accomplishments, things that succeed. Like, like, you get your own baby chickens or baby goats. Yeah, not only that, but, I don't know, I cannot think of something You're taking now. care of these animals and you're giving them good life. It's just... Yeah. I don't know. I, what I'm saying is, like, a lot of, actual, actually, a lot of people, a lot of couples, a lot, a lot of, yeah, people our age, they are dreaming of a homestead like ours. And for yeah. me, to be honest, it was never my dream. Like, I was, like, one day I want to have, like, a farmhouse or, like, have so many animals. I never really believed that, like, I will love it so much. I always loved animals. But, like, I didn't think I'm going to get so attached and I'm going to care so much and I'm going to be, like, so sad if something, you know, goes wrong and... But I really love our animals and yeah. yeah. I okay. have my What's your favorite snack? Oh, our favorite food, sorry. Food? Or snack? Mm -hmm. Food. Mm -hmm. um, I, can probably... I can tell for you. <laughs> probably. I like food. Food overall, I like, <laughs> depending on the season, I really like salads. Like yeah. any type, any kind. Like kind of mix everything together like I did last time. And for me? <laughs> for you? <laughs> it's, it's my favorite. We should answer for each other. It's my favorite. <laughs> your favorite? Well, it's noodle soup or dumplings <laughs> or soups overall. David, like he could live off soups, like um, army soups. 
soups, yeah. Like anything soup, pretty much. Noodle soup. Um, Any soup. Like just put carrots and potatoes in the soup, he will, he will eat it. Chicken soup, vegetable soup. Anything. Uh, Mashed potatoes. Root, like, root vegetable soup is yeah. my favorite. And, root uh, vegetable soup. Root vegetables. Like it's we all put Like all the, the baby food soup? No, root oh. vegetables means you oh. like beetroot, <laughs> yes, carrots. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Those are roots. I guess. Um, well, I thought you smart mush them and. No, no, no. <laughs> um, no, no. Mashed potatoes not my. F- mashed soups are not my favorite. Puree. Yeah. The, um, baby food for soups as we okay, call it. But we're snacks, speaking. we don't really have a favorite on snacks. Nah. We're not the biggest snack fans. Here and there, but not really snack. My mom dumplings. <laughs> dumplings, yeah. I love dumplings. I said it as well. You said it? Yeah. yeah. Dumplings. Anything I mean, soup, I, as you can tell, anything soup. I started getting a bit sick of eating dumplings. Oh, really? Honest. Yeah. <laughs> Need to find the. Okay. Maybe I started making my own dumplings because those are much better. It's a different, it's a different taste. <laughs> making my own pasta was complete oh yeah, my own pasta was really. Yeah, it's, we haven't done it's completely while. different. I don't know if we have shown in the video, have we? We have shown. Yeah, in the we video. have shown. We have, it. I mean, um, a year ago. Yeah, bees. It's bees take a lot of time. That's why I haven't started, but I do need to learn it and do it when I have time. Uh, the grandpa from the neighbors, he actually was kind of uh, in disbelief that it's even going to work first time when we got it. Which one? Uh, the tractor. Oh, the green you need one. to say for what? Cause I, you know. For um, our neighbor's grandpa. Yeah. Uh, he actually said, I think maybe like 20, 30 times he has told me to get a mechanic that yeah. I will never be able to fix it. Uh, and which just encourages in a, you more. <laughs> yeah, but not in a mean way. Like <laughs> No, no, no. He's very supportive in that way. He's just, he wants you to succeed in those things. But uh uh, I think our neighbor like it's uh, hard to believe in someone that like at my age to be able to understand yeah. about this old machine that you know in, he, not even he understands and he would not take it on so that's 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 his point to get a mechanic and most people tell told us in comments as well to get a mechanic yeah. and, but <laughs> that you, boosts you more I think yeah you need to prove them wrong in theory but um, <laughs> but in theory it's all understandable once you learn it yeah uh, anyways we skipped it. The address to send things. There is an address to send things. I don't know how well it works, but I it's don't. We haven't posted video. Anymore. No, it I was below play. something video. Mm, we need to it's be, it it's one. it's below. I think one of. But the, the problem is, I don't know how good customs are now. Custom, customs customs suck. We had actually a package that came from America. Uh, a viewer sent it, and we um, paid for it. Received the customs fee. We paid for it. Fifty euros. It Fifty was. euros. We paid for customs. And when we go to get it, and they say it's uh, not here, they sent it back. Because you haven't paid or something like that. Yeah, uh, you didn't come to the spot to pay or something. I paid online because it was an online yeah. version. Um, but yeah, that was So I don't know how good it is. Sending thing from Europe, it's okay. But when it's coming yeah. out of Europe, it's just difficult. Because we have uh, from Sweden yeah. sending seeds <laughs> and stuff. <laughs> Send us again sweets. Thank you so much. Uh my my daughter hates soup. No, I love soups. <laughs> everything soups. I mean, not everything soups, but soups. Well, you don't like my fish soups. soup. No, fish soup, no. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to add them. Uh, oh, no, don't worry. I re- <laughs> I'm reading everything. Sorry. Potato soup. Yeah, anything with potatoes. I, I like my vegetable soups. Squash, you smell like kashrol. onion. Why did you eat onion? Yeah, like, it's, it's, a very it's, strong, like onion. it's a very strong onion. Root vegetable stew. Yeah. Sweet I love potato. Cook, we don't like sweet potato. The biggest sweet potato. I'm not the biggest fan of sweet potatoes. I, like I can potatoes. eat it if it's in the food. I'm not. Yeah. I'm not. No, I'm not I'm picky, not a picky like that, eater. Yeah. But you can use wood wash and water to slow the butterfly destroys your garden. Yeah, I also saw that you can just kind of put nets over it. Everything. The... Someone said if they can send it to my mom instead. I don't know how the law is there. I think they're the customers. There's worse. Also. There's worse. Greece. Is, Europe. Greece is Europe worse. overall is fine, but just like outside of Europe is the problem. Yeah, sweet potato mush. Uh, can we send you mom? Ah, there you are. You reading it after? <laughs> wood wash sounds good. I don't know. Ah, uh, wood wood ash. Yeah. Ah. Did you say wood ash? Ah, wood, wood ash. ash. Slow the butterflies. Ah, I, I read wood wash. Wood ash. <laughs> I was like, what? Wood wash? Ah, ash. I mean, we Do need to find my... butterflies? Yeah, I guess. I mean, ah, wood okay. ash is good for fertilizer as well. Uh, also, That's like the... our neighbor said, to put in a very uh, moist day uh, for the bushes to kill the moss. Kill the, uh, to the destroy bu- the moss the because the berry bushes are just getting covered yeah. with moss. Sweet potatoes, fries. Uh, as fries and Ooh, maple, maple syrup, syrup glaze. glaze. I, just, mm. I love maple syrup. Chickens and dumplings, easy to make and yummy. <laughs> I've never tried. I usually, I think I used pork for dumplings when I made them. But uh, no, I was following online together. recipes. In Latvia, the recipes are mostly with pork, I think, they use. Or vegetables as well. You can make a vegetable, like yeah, mushrooms or something. Yeah. So there's many ways. Uh, okay, any other questions? <laughs> <laughs> the 
There's a lot in common. Which place are you born? He asks. I'm born oh. in uh, Leopaya. It's a sea yeah. seaside. Yeah, I'm a seaside boy. <laughs> <laughs> and he loves the sea. Like he loves yeah. the beach and the water. Water is my favorite. No, Actually, I do. I did love water as a kid. I was in the lake three times a day. I was lake yeah, was where I lived. Around. Yeah, but I think overdoing it as a kid makes me now not so interested in it because no. it's not the same anymore. Well, it's not okay. that same energy of just like, jumping. Like last in. summer, if I get to jump in the water, like somewhere to jump from, I love it. But if I just have to go swim, it's <laughs> but boring. then he gets a headache because he jumps so many times. Yes, that happens as well. <laughs> or to, like I like jumping from high things, but then even bigger headaches, like cliffs in yes, Greece. Yes, I know. That was so much fun. But then you get a big headache. So, yeah, How that's... How do you dive? You dive like a, with a boom, not with your head. You? you can dive with the head. I dive with the head. Oh, that's where you get a headache. Of course. It's dangerous from height. But, yeah, sweet potato and pumpkin pie is wonderful. I have to try when we have time. I've been a vegan for nine years, absolutely. Sweet potatoes. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, when you're a vegan, there's so much more, more you have to explore and combine yeah. uh we also looked into mushrooms as being a meat replacing and mushrooms are just so amazing in so many ways you can cook them Pastas. you didn't like mushrooms before you might know. yeah i didn't <laughs> eat much mushrooms but we have so many mushrooms locally here that we can make a lot of things and a lot of mushrooms have different tastes here as well do we have any new project announcements announcement what's the new project we did say it wait what's our new project the, I mean, the, oh. this house there. yeah an extension next to the kitchen an extension for dining table. dining table. Table, the, the, dining room it's <laughs> it's a mini dining room next to the kitchen because we don't have a proper dining room yeah so it's going to be kind of like a circle table in a little and floor. another project <clears throat> for the house is we want to build a full glass house like the side where the chickens are now yeah, where the that's gonna go chicken away. house, the, not the chicken house, but their current chicken house, the veranda is. It's like a mud room. It was a mud room for that. Yeah. That was the main entrance of the house uh, when it was first constructed. So we're thinking to make but this whole away. thing like a glass house for future for having a bigger dining dining place with a pizza oven inside and the smokery yeah. and to have more space made for future for kids to play around. I'm a Latvian born in Canada. Oh, it's very nice to hear. <laughs> want to grow our own firewood yes we could on our ditch but i don't know is that enough pig in three quarters i don't know what that what is that a saying <laughs> oh that's i don't know <laughs> why would you say that it, it, if you want to say i can say in latvian it's it's a pig in latvian is tsuka and three quarters is uh three saturdays but um hmm. i don't know why would you say that you asking me. <laughs> Anyways, I never, I just never heard that saying. If Desi made it, I would eat it. Oh, his uh, father used to call him that. Ah. Love the extension plants. Yeah, extensions, extensions, extensions. Mushrooms are fantastic. <laughs> it's too funny. <laughs> Thanks for the live stream. We'll be watching. Take care. Thank you so much. Well, thank, thank you for so all the, the questions. And all the kind comments as well. Yeah. Um, Did we answer, like, how are we doing after three years? I don't know. Yeah, we had to say, yeah. <laughs> um, I mean, we're doing good. It's not like we're doing bad. No, we're not. We're doing a lot better than the first year, that's for sure. First year was a complete mess. We are, are what we realize is that our powers are not as much as they were the first year. I think we drained a bit. What did we drain? Ah, the, the power. I think what not power we, like how much we can lift like this type of power like like that how much we push at one time but it was what was pushing us forward was to get those things done like I guess, when you yeah. don't have a bedroom you need to push very hard to get it done when you don't have a kitchen a you want to push to get very hard yeah so you're like very focused and very determined but now, now we kind of have relaxed because the we problem have yeah it's like you are comfy and yeah. comfort is not good because in comfort you don't <laughs> succeed and that's bad yeah so it's it's bad to so say so we're but. doing. Good overall. It's it's Let's you. Pro, you're much more productive when you're struggling. That's for sure. Or when you're under pressure. Yeah. Like in summer when under our pressure, yeah. like summer helper was here, it was pushing us to wake up early and do yeah. things. And you know he's working. You cannot just sit and be lazy. No. You know it just like feels bad. You so. wake up earlier and yeah. you had to work. Yeah. It was it was, was good. good. Yeah. And we <laughs> gave him a computer and a monitor, and like a full computer setup for him. So very good to help him out. And in that yeah. case, it's. Better than giving just money and, you know, buys all kinds of things for himself. So, um... There was someone here. Was you missed comments. Comment. There was one. Yeah, we're most on <laughs> I read it. It's from, um... It's Jax from UK. 
been following since the beginning of the pandemic. Uh, in my opinion, one of the most authentic couples on YouTube. Love watching Try. <laughs> your lives. Um, hard work ethic. Sorry, I read. I, I, I skip a lot of words when I'm reading because I pre-read yeah. them. I don't know. I When I read comments, for example, I read them very fast. It's. I think you learn that with you need to read, read through 100 comments yeah. in like a few hours. So you, you spot read. You I, read very <laughs> quickly. So I'm sorry if I'm skipping a lot of words from the text. But yeah, thank you so much. Yeah. It's very kind. It's uh, it's very nice to know that. Yeah, we're trying like our, our best. We're being ourselves. But um, yeah, also. I wouldn't, yeah. We, of course, we don't show the hard times or the bad times. Or no, yeah, yeah, cry of course. Around I mean. or, you know. But we are pretty authentic. Like, you know, if things go wrong, we show them. We don't. Yeah. <laughs> we don't try to hide like, well, life yeah. is perfect either. It's, no. it's a lot of times it's but not. But we're also not going to make a video where we complain about everything that goes wrong or like. Yeah, no, no, no. <clears> or <throat> take, just... take everything. with. We don't take all the comments serious either, yeah. like all the bad comments. and. Like you see a lot of people like responding specifically to the bad comments. Like, okay, move on. No, no, like... it's it's perfectly. It's everyone has their opinion. I just Yeah, of course. It. Like. Um, Missed the live stream. You can watch it from the start. It's still there. It's hey, not gonna, gonna go upload away. It as well. We're gonna upload it so you can skip through. What Front mudroom is finishing in spring. Hopefully. Hopefully. Energy and motivation. Yeah. Yeah. You. If the stream is a bit laggy, then it will be after, so you can watch it. Yeah. So it will be more. We like will a video upload then. it, so in case you miss something, or I'm gonna go back. Yeah. Our internet speed actually is, is pretty great, but I have bought two giant antennas that are going on, to, on top of the roof. I can bring them. <laughs> that are going on top of the roof and will make it huge. <laughs> so yeah, he, he got them and like he put them in the middle of the room and our room was a mess as well. So I was like, what are you doing? Oh, goodness. <laughs> They're gonna look pretty damn beautiful though on the roof. No, they will not. No, no, they will definitely not look good on a farmhouse. But these will improve our speeds to be pretty much like living yeah. in the city. So you point these at the tower and you get the same <laughs> speed as, you know, yeah. living there. Yeah, I, I, it's not like necessary that we need very good internet. But it's annoying when the internet is not good. And it frustrates you, so. Yeah, no, internet is very necessary. Especially when you do beautiful house looks in the back when it's all nice cleaned up. Yeah. It's pretty beautiful. It's a very nice arc <laughs> to the bathroom. <laughs> Not not working, like not uh, functioning. Yeah, it would be cool if you could just open that. But no, that would also no, not be useful. Then you would walk into the shower. Into the shower. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, wait, wait, we skipped everything. Yeah. You got through the tractor. Yeah, tractor was a mess. Um, the Saloniki Greece. Yeah. Yes, yes. Yes, I Oh, it feels so weird speaking Greek after speaking so long English. What will you use basement for? Basement will be for basement purposes such purposes, as purposes, uh, <laughs> such as canned foods yeah potatoes, potatoes carrots, uh, carrots beets, beets um apples. apples we need to see because apparently you're not allowed to put those two things together apples you're and allowed, carrots but... apparently not because you get the carrots yeah and potato taste yeah well if you like a potato taste you get on a your potato apple. taste on your apple or oh, or something goodness. like i don't remember the purpose but my aunt said it's no good and i think neighbors also said no yeah good. no uh we no, have so p.o we... box we had a p.o box uh not much was arriving and uh no we got the apartment that's why they cancelled it as well yeah no we cancelled it because we got the apartment so we didn't want to pay for a p.o box if we have the apartment the apartment yeah is not planned to be sold so we have that address yeah. to be receiving things yeah that's it's a public address pretty much <sighs> Your videos, I'm a favorite. Thank you so much. You're getting get married soon. <laughs> no. uh, agree with YouTube. Do you soon, guess? I did not. <laughs> no. Okay. Have to watch potato storage. What's the best way to keep? Uh, do you, blah, blah, blah. What's the best way you do potato soup? I don't know. I put potato potatoes soup? in a lot of soups. I do with. No, you don't do. I don't do a pure potato no. soup. I put four or five potatoes, carrots. And then the next main ingredients, you know, it could be chickpeas, could beans, be beans, lentils, could be yeah, like lentils. any kind of like bean related. And then there's also beetroot soup. Then there's the pickle soup. Ooh. Pickle soup. Ooh, that's <laughs> one of the favorites. Um, we do meatball soup. Yeah. Um, the Greek uh, chicken soup. Yeah, uh, Greek. Greek. With half of a lemon. Uh, yeah, with le loads of lemon. We love lemon. Yeah. Uh, we eat loads of lemon. Way too much lemon. I love lemon. I love more and, lemon though. No, and then like a year, like two years ago, she like got addicted. Uh, well, you try to make a new pew pew this year. Um, it's we, not on our. Face. Not yeah. It's if she wants to, she will. 
Um, we could try to incubate some, but it's pretty hard. Yeah, I rather let her do it naturally, so and she can also succeed. And then yeah, also she will take care of them, and and they will attack us even more because they're oh. so aggressive right now. They, they already run aggressive. after you like as soon as they see you. They have no brain of remembering that they <laughs> they like you're their owner. It's it's ridiculous. They, I don't know. Like the, the thing is, they come after you. They try to attack you. They try to bite you, and then they stop. Yeah, and then they like get the courage again, like oh, they're getting hungry. But oh, we need to finish. Weird. That's why we need to finish the chicken house because she will start laying yeah. eggs soon, and uh, it can be very difficult to move her if she chickens lays eggs easy. in the wrong place. Chickens very easy. We just put them, lock them for two three days, and then they will think that's their house forever. Yeah, because they need to make an egg. Look, they, so. they can't hold it, so they will have to make it somewhere. Yeah. And another egg boxes are pretty good. They already transitioned from this place to the current place, so that's pretty. Yeah, stickers. Easy. Uh, we were actually thinking about stickers because we don't have a sticker. We have the cutter which cuts out stickers. We just haven't had the time to really yeah. design it and get even the paper. It's like so little amount of time on things that it's hard to assemble all these jobs. Mm -hmm. um, the merch was fun. It was really fun to do, but it was also hard to keep up, and especially with the problems of deliveries and things <laughs> like that. Was making it more harder, but stickers would be an easy thing to do. Yeah, we just need to see how to do them on the cutter. And yeah, and it all. ships. It ships with just like an envelope, so it's yeah. also very like easy to ship. We will see. It's Work on the merch thing. There's so much things we could do. We could also do cups and all kinds of things. We have actually cups the, is only the problem. We have the printing of cups, but it's yeah, it shipping can, it can break as well. Yeah. Um, my brother asked if I will remember the streets when I go back to Greece. Oh, I still I, I, so. I remember them in my head. In, I, I don't remember to. names. If I've I have to drive some them. like. If I have to think where to go somewhere in Athens, I can I can plan I can, out. I can plan it out easily. Yeah. It's no problem. If I was there on the same streets, I would be I like, think. yeah, we go there. It's not you don't remember you don't forget those things. I think I mean, after you have driven along. those things thousands of times. Unless the streets change too much, but I doubt no, it. Like I don't think so. I think you would always remember. You miss traveling. Um, not so much. No, it's a lot of stress. Yeah, it's unnecessary stress. <laughs> yeah. Like when I went to Germany, it was like I was excited, but like. I don't know, it's just also like leaving the animals behind even though I knew they were with you. I don't yeah. know, it's a bit, it's a bit stressful. Yeah, we have so much, so much things here that it's hard to travel. Yeah. It's, um... And I want someone that I can rely on, like, yeah. I cannot just like... It's also not like the most needed for us mentally to, travel, to just no. be traveling, like... No, no, We have no. seen most of the Europe already, Sometimes so. I get phases where I'm like, oh, I would like just to go there, but yeah. then like, ah, it's okay. It's more like for a week, you just go and that's it. Not even. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear Kate. Kate is walking around. Kate? Yeah. She's looking around to see if anything fell down. Yeah, she does the uh, evening uh, cleanup. Like, our cleaning lady doesn't work in the evening, she works in the morning, and Kate does the evening rounds. Yeah, like, if anything falls place. down from the kitchen, Kate is just. It's mine. Yes. She's she's very excited. <laughs> she, eat, she eats anything. She eats oranges, she eats. Anything you would give her, she eats except, I think, onions and garlic. Onions and garlic, so she knows. And I think a carrot. She carrot like. she doesn't like. Potatoes Ooh, she likes. Potatoes Apples she, she likes. likes. Apples she likes. Are we still making t-shirts? Yeah, we're still yeah. making them. Um, but it's not, it's not as busy, but sometimes we Someone do. Someone said, you want to make a soup making video? A soup making video? <laughs> <laughs> I would see a series, yeah. I don't know. That's... That's a lot of videos. We actually said like <laughs> last year, last the time we, we had We should make a, a channel stream. maybe for no. food. <laughs> no, we said last time when we did a um, live stream, we said that we will live stream recipes. We ah, did it. like we're going to be live streaming like, talking we should maybe and making make food. It, yeah, yeah, we could be easily. Like we could make it like kind of like every other Sunday or something. Yeah. We haven't announced what we will be doing actually from tomorrow on and every Saturday. Yeah, have we said it as we're gonna do I it. I think so. Like, like, um, yeah, I know, but we have to do it. I think it's gonna be. I don't know. We're gonna let them decide if they want us to do it. Yeah. Okay. What do you guys think? Whoever's yeah. here, what do you guys think about filming? About us filming reacting videos on our old videos? Yes, we wanna react on our old videos, and we decided we wanna do it from now on because it has been three years since we have arrived here. So it would be very fun to react on the older videos, see our reaction of what we could have done different, or like what are we doing so let us know if you think that that's a good idea for us to do like kind of like a tv show series of every sun saturday yeah. of reacting on our older videos it's gonna be like reacting on three videos in one video we're gonna cut out parts we don't want yeah and yeah let us know <laughs> if you like that there was idea. a comment about a wood stove as well the wood stove is doing amazing and yeah. with those wood brickets we got um amazing amazing we heat it up now I think it was on 19 degrees, 18. 
we in- heat it up. We finish heating up at uh, twelve. Yeah, it's it dropped down. I should be starting fire now. It's dark. I, I should. Yeah. Fire should be going already, but it's okay. I'll no, we start it always at. Eight it's pretty or warm now. Yeah. Um, but usually when I heat it up, it goes up to twenty five, like no problem. Make a cookbook. <laughs> I could, in theory, yeah. What do you saw the cookbook? Last comment. Oh. Um, <laughs> A person never liked any reacting videos. Yeah, some people like it, some people don't. Yeah. And also I want to say... It would be more like you watching the old video again, if you have seen it, and just us reacting to it and adding comments of personal... Like personal ...information like, yeah. that maybe wasn't seen in the video. Like, that kind of video. It's not like, just like, oh, oh my God, what oh, did we wow, do? Oh, yeah. wow, what happened? Or, oh, yeah. But it's more just us watching it and commenting on it. And reacting and being very harsh, because we are kind of like a harsh... Um, we're, ju- we're pretty much judging, judging ourselves, yeah. <laughs> like, kind of, like, judging ourselves. And also I wanted to say about the shorts, a lot of people, like, um, were, like, not fans of it. And, like, oh, now we're making only short videos. But we kind of wanted to do it because now YouTube likes short videos. No, it's, it's yeah, YouTube is very um, aggress- aggressive with it because they are pretty much putting the channels and not posting out shorts. They're just decreasing their reach, which means, like, yeah. more, more people don't see it. So if you're not a viewer that watches as often, you might not see our video just because YouTube says, no, we're not showing you anymore. And that's very mean because they're just doing it so their people post shorts. Yeah. I've been people saying we should do it. Yeah. <laughs> it's enough. <laughs> I also wanted to do it. I want to see the old videos. We started watching like two minutes. I was like, no, stop it. What if we do like a reacting? Because we were like already like sitting like that in front of the monitor, like what did we do? Like this and that. Yeah. It's like so I was it's, thinking. It's silly seeing the things we're doing. Like in the tractor repair videos I was watching. It's like, how did I not know that? And how did yeah. I not know that? And why was it doing that? And how did I not check that? Yeah, it's like us judging our younger selves. Yeah, it's pretty much a judgmental video. <laughs> so maybe maybe it's interesting. Yeah. I don't know. We could try one and then see. You need to change the cha- cha- a cooking show. Cooking show. Yeah. <laughs> We could change our channel like to many things. We've yeah. been actually thinking to make separate channels for everything, but like I don't think that's gonna make sense. Yeah. So like to keep up with all the channels, like make a farm one, make a build one, make a no, girls no. one, make a boys one, like like our interests. <laughs> Cooking videos, <laughs> comfortable doing them, yeah. Like live streams. We should set that. Like we yeah. have to. Because it's also fun, like, at the start, I was pretty stressed to start the live, but, like, once you get into the talking and once we do it more often, I think it's going better. How is the roof your house holding up this one? The roof is perfectly fine. It, it's not like the roof needs changing. It's not a hole in it. And um, it's kind of starting to flake, but it is, um, like, kind of a slate roof thingy. So yeah. it kind of lasts long, even if it starts to flake. I but also like the it needs changing. I also like the um, happy home making anniversary. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. It's a cool name. Replacing it this summer next. We would love to replace it. It's just financial. It's yeah. all of this. We're set in our way. Like as we said, like once we have like the financial set and the project going, like we can do projects pretty fast. Like with a god barn. So yeah. Maybe not for everyone. No, we're not gonna react to every video because some just don't need reacting. What? Uh, we can skip over it quickly and oh yeah of course say... I'm just saying it's gonna be like not one video like reacting to one it's gonna be like three different like always three or four videos yeah we're just gonna skip through it like you know what whatever mean, needs reacting. talking about yeah yeah what we want to react not that interesting we're not gonna show all the talking and stuff no 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 not all the like good mornings and explaining no, of what no, we're gonna no, do and no no not those things it's more like reacting to many things at once yeah that's like three, four doing. different videos. It's, a, it's extra job for us and we have to see if we have the time to do it. No, the thing is that it also helps us by <clears throat> keeping up posting. Because then it's like um, an easier video for us to film. Less of like manual work. So that's why we I decided we could do that just to have like more relaxing day. Because it's easier to film and easier to edit faster. So it's not like that much. No, yeah. The, um, Liz says about the roof and uh, the roof has absolutely no problem. The structural integrity is like no. beyond good. The, there's not much rot on the woods at all. They would not need changing in theory. Um, it's once you start ripping things out, then you need to start you working to. and you want it good for many years. But for now, it can probably sit another 10 years and not even have yeah. any leaks in it. We have like one or two tiny leaks or snow blowing through. Snow blowing through is pretty normal. It's nothing yeah. bad. And it neighbors... ventilates and just yeah. dries out. But our neighbors have like same quality kind of roof. and They also yeah. want to change it, but they want to put uh, clay, tiles, clay tiles, which is um, heavy and uh, quite expensive. 
Uh, and paper bags. Oh, interesting. Wrap their potatoes. Uh, not potatoes. Uh, apples and carrots and onions and paper bag. <laughs> it keeps them in cold storage. Usually keeps anyways. Uh, as long as it's dark and cold, it stays no matter what. Yeah. And you n need to pick through once in a while from all the moldy ones, like uh, who's rotting away, not to rot the rest. It's also gonna be like more. See you, projects. Michelle. Michelle is leaving. Michelle, oh. bye bye. Oh, hope you hope you enjoy team next. <laughs> <laughs> it was ha nice having you here. Now, more projects and less feeding the animals. So the problem is that we, you know, we, I don't know how to explain yeah, it. Yeah, it's, like, it's, it's easy. I would love to do more projects and a lot more working videos or, or, or to do more projects, but it's physically like sometimes really hard. Yes. And um, a lot of times that's what it is. It's a lot of periods are just feeding animals because in the minus, like when it was what minus 25, do, there's like, really nothing we could do. No. And like, it's better than not posting any video. We'd rather post something. Yeah. I know it was like... In the winter when we we're filming, it was freezing. Your hands are just freezing. You're trying yeah, to hold the camera. I couldn't hold the, the, the buttons. Like, and literally those fingers froze. So like, there's not many things we can do outside. Yeah. And the problem is that we cannot do so many big projects and renovation projects if physically, we, financially, it's difficult yeah. and yeah. It's, That's what we, you know, we have to set priorities and we try to do, I don't know, like and to relax them. and and yeah. winter is very good for relaxing as well because YouTube doesn't yeah. you know, pay the best so we can relax a bit more as well. Yeah. So that's um, why you see us sometimes doing more work or less work and. Yeah. Why Latvia? I don't know. Latvia is just, it's my home country and it's, yeah. um, economy is, is what? it was cheap. <laughs> so we could get the farmhouse for very cheap. Of course, there's countries in Europe even cheaper, Yeah. but the quality of living in Latvia is not comparable to those countries. It feels like you're living in a very nice country, like it a very rich like, country. Like a Switzerland or yeah. Like and, sometimes but really the costs good. are not comparable. Now they're kind of increasing. They're higher than Germany in most cases, <laughs> but, um, that's just the uh, financial problems. I still laugh when I see this finger pointing at the end. I have seen a lot of comments at the start. A lot of people were like, oh, she needs to have the last word. But a lot of people actually enjoyed. So sometimes I don't know what to say. And I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> sometimes yeah. I don't have like a last comment. But sometimes I say, I say to David what, you know, we should say. And then he forgets something. That's why I'm just like pointing and saying it out. The structure of our house is very different than North America. Our house uh, is very common in Latvia, uh, but the structure of these houses are pretty much like a fortress because it's double double brick wall, um, which is very good as because it's insulated. It, inside is just an air gap, and uh, the stones go one meter fifty deep. It's yeah. just it's so many things to just love about the house that are just you know it's gonna stay even if the house burns down, the walls the would walls stay up. No, no, it's a very bad thing to happen. No. But um, just saying, it's a, it's a very sturdy house in that sense. And the wood that they used is very good as well. Um, yeah. What else was it? I missed probably now some comments. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, near Riga, yeah. we're pretty far. Riga is not. I don't really like capitals. I get no. stressed when I go there. It's nothing. We've seen me. Riga. We've seen, seen it in many winter, times. We yeah. saw it in summer. I think we. I, I'm not. Don't need to go. <laughs> What is the name of the dog? The the neighbor's dog, you mean? It's uh, Barons. I, right? Neighbor's dog or our dog? I, it says a uh, loner dog. I don't I know. Guess loner, I guess loner, yeah. I guess it's Barons. What do you... What do you... Lera. Did you, look <laughs> much <better? sighs> you two have accomplished so much short time. Thank you. Need to fill up the gap between the, the bricks, yes. They, I think in between the two walls. Uh, the gap between the two bricks we're going to fill up with compact uh, rock wool or there was some foam. few not alternatives. Foam, foam probably not. Uh, natural. We're going to use something natural. But um, it's really not that expensive. Um, it was around 700 but now with the price increase probably yeah. it's a few thousand. It was 700 when we came here. We didn't have that money. If we'd had it then, we should have done it straight away. Yeah. Now it would be a lot more expensive with the new price of insulation. But again, like the and priorities. Workforce, and workforce. <laughs> but it, it really, the house is cooling down so slowly. Like, you know, from being warm to, to, to cold is very, very slow. So yeah, no the need. neighbor's German Shepherd, Barons, he's very, extremely hyperactive. Like, he is like the <laughs> definition of hyperactivity, I think. Yeah. <laughs> he's like a complete opposite of like Keita. Perlet, yeah, I think that's another one. But it's, uh, they like compress it in with force so i don't know there's the only limited amount of materials you can use for those walls because you can't go from up up is all sealed so 
It's only from digging, uh, drill a hole, put it in. Black okay. and white kitty. It's just a, do- a cat that just came from nearby farm somewhere, just joined in. Kind of yeah. like a field barn cat. He really, the first year, he really didn't. He was no, extremely he, scared. He was scared, running away, hitching us. And then all of a sudden, and he then, just started no, petting No, and then we started feeding him in winter, the first winter we were here. And then the second, uh, only last year in autumn, yeah. he randomly out of nowhere petted my, uh, my leg. And <laughs> that was like, that's it. <laughs> yeah. Regular life clog, uh, life logs, clogs. <laughs> I love the work. It's also yeah. missed behind the scene clips sometimes. Uh, don't know. Kind of like our vlogs are. No, we. I actually, mean, we don't show. Yeah, we don't show our personal part of our life. Like behind I guess. the scenes, I guess also. Like, no, but it's we more don't like show in the videos. Life. Like what so we did in, as early. Yeah, video. that's what we wanted to do as a short. Yeah. So. We wanted to, but it took so much time and it gets you, well, not mo- like it gets you like nothing. Like it but... takes us as long, like to make one short video takes pretty much as long as me editing a big video. Yeah. With so the whole it's... process of uploading and figuring yeah. it out. And, and posting all the platforms. The platforms. Yeah, it's and it's also the problem that time. it needs to be 60 seconds. We have a very big struggle with that. You know, no, we love talking, no. we love explaining things. So it's hard. Yes. Yeah. It's hard. We will see, like the trimming the goat's hooves and those kind of things we can do. So we'll see what else. Or maybe some cooking videos, I guess. Yeah. Maybe? Projects uh, can be low key and not always about the money. So lots of projects we do. Um, mostly all of them. <laughs> mostly all of them are like budget oh, yeah. as budget as they get. And even if even if we had the money, we'd still try to see how we can reuse and do it cheaper and better. Like the chicken. Because they just come out so more authentic, so much more natural when you just try to find a way to do it instead of just throw money at, money at it and put it brand new. No, like better. the chicken coop we made is like yeah. fully repurposed. Except, Except the, the roof. <laughs> and the insulation. Insulation as well. But the OSB that we're going to put inside is from the apartment. The yeah. woods were from the old chicken barn. And the woods yes. were also repurposed. Like we already, like we also support a lot the idea of like reusing, repurposing, yeah. and it's a lot cheaper. Of the, uh, a lot and of the also... wood, yeah. We have used up most of our wood storage though, so we're running out of <laughs> wood to use for projects because we're just using more than we are. Favorite is David. We have we had the GoPro. We were using GoPro pretty often, but then we lost it. So don't know where it is since the excavator. Uh, maybe left it in the excavator or the storage. We checked, it. but. Excavator was empty when we let it away, so I don't know where 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 would it could be. Maybe in the grass somewhere, got buried, no, but grass is all checked. gone. Yeah, so we've checked, we've cut everywhere. Ah, my waist is starting to <laughs> go talking so much. <clears throat> How much have we talked for? Ah, one hours. hour thirty. Yeah, it's not really but not for that like much, another ten but... minutes or something. I don't know what time. Yeah, it is. reaction videos. Yes. Okay, so I guess we'll do them, see how they go, if you like them. Hardware store and thrift store videos. Uh, hard, a thrift store is coming up. We want to do it we today. Want to do, yeah, we said it. But it might be next week, someday. Yeah, we have to go. We have to go to my doctor's appointment, so we kind of combine it all together. Yeah. And then, as well, we're going to film at my aunt's place. If you guys enjoy seeing that, it's going to be at my aunt's place building the um, but we have wood to do house. It. We maybe don't show again, like cutting wood. Cutting wood, we're not going to show. It's <laughs> Three times is definitely going to be repetitive. Four. Um, four times. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, we have three times. Last time was with the tractor. It was kind of interesting. A bit yeah. more. I, I liked it. Maybe we lot. film it and put it together with something else. But uh, no, I don't think so. I think it's just okay. we're focused on work. We finish because it's very little work left for finishing yeah. for this year. And then we're done with the wood. But then we need processing. Processing we can film once. And then fully we need to build, uh, not build, but restore their um, wood storage. Wood shed, what it's called. Where we're going to be storing our wood. You are creating you. She just wants to go down. She doesn't like in uh, sitting on. on. She likes it. She likes yeah, it. definitely. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's not like. A, I don't know. We have trained. Can I say? She's definitely get a metal snowing. metal detector. Yeah, we're getting a metal detector. My oh, uncle really wants know. one. Because okay. uh, on my uncle's land, we can do a full yeah. video just about the land that's there that they are on. Oh. It used to be called the Red Line because it's um, World War Two. It's a big um, war line where there were, a lot of war happened. So it's a lot of things buried there, a lot of uh, treasures from the World War II and a lot of German treasures because their yeah. house was as a German um, headquarters. So it's packed with lots of golds and a lot of people have undigged it from his land already. So it would be very interesting just to talk about that. But that's not the most interesting topic for most people who are not obsessed <laughs> with World War II stuff. I mean, um, we're also not going to show. No, of course, we don't show anything. We no. just try to find <laughs> things. 
a new GoPro. Thank you. That would be nice. Um, it it was useful when it was. Yeah, your barns with the design windows are outstanding. Thank you the, so the much. The goat yeah. barn, right? Goat barn. Yeah. Which barn? Well, many barns. The goat barn, I think, because that has the window design. Every like, barn for... has good windows. No, the window design, I think. But also yeah, the design. big barn has cool windows. The that's not a design. Window. Oh, I guess that's also the window design. It is very cool. Like, and for that example, barn has a cool design with the little I triangles. Guess. And also different <laughs> child. It's many barns. I mean, he said barns. She, he said barns. Barns, yes, yeah, all, so the, all barns. the barns. Yes. Yeah. Now, like for example, also the windows there, they're also reused, repurposed from other. Things. For uh, lumber, we actually are gonna try making our lumber. My uncle has a lumber mill. Uh, he, he actually bought one for making lumber, so we're gonna try it. And we actually cut some of the trees we pulled with the tractor. Those are gonna, actually gonna try to cut in planks and beams. So we're gonna try it for sure. Different lands always yeah. nice, yeah. And the uh, way they live, we can give a bit better tour. Uh, they don't mind us filming it. And um, they have a lot to show and a lot of stories to tell and uh, yeah. a lot of things, cool things to also renovate and help them because <laughs> their basement collapsed in, their house burned down. A lot of things are just left and untouched. Like, you know, they don't have the power to do it. So we're going to step in to help because yeah. they don't have anyone else. So it will be interesting to bring you guys along. Someone said... What country we live in? Latvia. History of area would be so cool. This area specifically, it has history, but not as exciting. Not as exciting. Here was more like Soviet Union came. Uh, There was 13... No, 13 was... There was 10, 11, you said. 13, I think. um, Neighbors said there was 13 houses here in this place where there's only two left. So 11 houses. The bulldozer just came and down. All the buildings gone. Everyone to the city. You live in an apartment now. Yeah. So it was really like nasty to hear that history. And the people went to oh, most, yeah, Siberia. Siberia. Those who got sent out to Siberia, or you go live in an apartment. Yeah, you don't deserve a farmhouse. Only farmers got uh, those who are actually contributing to yeah. Soviet Union. Those were allowed to stay. And uh, up there, where we come in, our road was a big two-story brick house that looked like a mansion. Our neighbor said, and it was uh, after it was split for like uh, ten apart- apartments for all the people to live. And after they just bulldozed it. It had no yeah. fault. Nothing, they just took it all down because they didn't want you to have it. And that's it. Soviet Union re- destroyed the, um, the country <laughs> the quite col- a lot. Yeah. The whole far- like the whole farmlands, like everything, all the ha- farmhouses are all gone. Someone said make all kinds of videos and people watch whatever they like. I also like that we make videos and I know a lot of people <clears throat> that the girls watch the things they want to watch, the guys watch the things that David does. So I like about our channel that it's also, I don't know, everyone can yeah. watch it. Kids can watch it, can watch the animal videos, guys can watch the tractor videos, girls can watch the cooking videos. Yeah, it's, it's not, like not every, everything not everything for everyone, but also um, like I think with us too, I don't think David will watch everything that we do, like the cooking ones or the collecting yeah. the tea or those things. And I don't know if I would necessarily watch all the videos. Not that you wouldn't watch the tractors watch. for sure. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Two hundred nooks. Is that, it's, is that Norwegian. it's Norwegian, oh, yeah. <laughs> I think. Norwegian so um, Corona? Corn- no, Cornelius. Do they have Corona? That's a nice name. Yeah, very nice. Um, Someone behind, asked behind the, the bottles. bottles. The, <laughs> the syrup. It's very hard alcohol. No, it's uh, syrup. Syrup. Yeah. We try not to consume too much. What else do we have? Oh, that's all we have, actually. That's Thank you so left. much, Cornelius. Thank you so much. That's all we have left from ice cream. And hazelnut is it. <laughs> it's too much that's sugar. All there is. Um, for our puppies, that's it. <laughs> that's all we have back there, and some cookies. Yeah, we're gonna link it down maybe in a video, like next Which upcoming one? video, or I can link it in this uh, video after it's finished at the end. Uh, the PO box, like to send yeah. us. Uh, we have the address of our things. apartment. Yeah, it's you. I'm gonna try to put it best to best as I can. Latvia known for Latvia, I don't know. Latvia known more. Sing and dance. They're big on singing and dancing. Yeah. But traditional, they have a lot very of traditional. Culture and culture, yeah, nice they're very cultural say. oriented. Very like they, they care a lot about their country. About preservance of, of like buildings, our things age, like that. Our age teenage. Like they come back or like of course young kids from every country don't really they care preser- about the country. They love preserving uh, old traditions. Yeah. Because we have so much festivals and events just around old traditions mm. it's around europe a lot but um it's it's very heavy here as well like most of the festivals are traditional greek greece is also cool yeah the greece is also pretty good and also preserving old traditions in uh, local small towns 
can you uh, okay go folk through dance that. costume is wonderful yeah i did folk dancing for i think seven years or something so yeah i remember it yeah <laughs> do well. you well not really not the dances <laughs> you said you i remember, remember me in a costume oh, okay but you don't remember the steps yeah because if you no. ask me i also did greek dancing for no many i could years. probably do some the dancing was not the hardest it oh. was the learning the chor- choreography of everyone to dance correctly the dancing is very easy. The dancing is pretty basic. easy. It's just like... Uh, yeah, unless you setup. go to the main sing and dance festival, they do uh, some... Yeah, but it's the like whole, very... like, that. Yeah. Do. Greek dance is more complicated. I, if you would ask me, really, I also did many years, but... I'm Probably. Like, no, no. But as we saw the traditional dancing festival, which was all the country's dancing yeah. festival, and it was, like, mostly similar, but... Yeah, they, they all have thing. kind of similar. Of course, it's not, like, extreme differences. Yeah. Uh, someone said if we can receive um, Amazon deliveries amazon is a um, hit or miss because some things we can receive some things uh, not it's <clears throat> all depends what i want to say is that delivery in latvia i know in germany how awful it is the delivery and express delivery in latvia is like the best delivery system yeah. like if you buy something online it's gonna arrive fast we have those uh post like p.o boxes kind of where yeah. you put your code in and just pops it's open like Mats. yeah so you don't need to interact. You don't need to go to post office. You don't need to get the card. You need, don't it's need to wait. Seven, it's twenty four seven. You can go after work whenever you want, and it's not like usually it's a one two day delivery. Yes. Like when we did the t shirts now with the new supplier, we send him the like what we need, and yeah. he sends it out the same day usually if it's a work day, and it's next day here. You just go and pick it up, and then you pay whenever you want. You're on a contract, so you know you can't no, avoid what it. I, what I, but it's just instant. Yeah. What I like about those boxes is that. You don't interact with anyone, not like it's hard to interact, yeah. but you don't need to wait in a line. No chance of losing your package, like with Amazon yes. in US, I see a big thing is losing your package when they just leave it at your doorstep. I don't, yeah. will never understand that. Um, <laughs> and in Germany, a lot of times they say like the neighbor will sign yeah, they it. Ca- or, oh yeah, they came and you were not home. You were not left. home. Like oh, then That's why I love this Paco Mats. But and in Latvia, we also the get, couriers as well. We also get very good couriers that come to our house, like from so far away. So it's like really, really, really good. The Driving through system. middle of nowhere through the roads. Like that. I must and for free most, most okay, cases. Okay, we yeah. over talked. <laughs> How did you choose? Wood figures. Oh, that would be cool. Wait. Said in Latvia. Move... Oh. Moving there yet? No, she's heard How we cited the Latvian service. <laughs> Greece is overpriced. Overpriced, and the land is not that easy to work. No, on. you could not have much of a farmhouse. You would need to buy black dirt, yeah. black soil to even start farming. You could have all the lemon trees, orange trees, all of Yeah, you could those. have the locals, but even that needs all irrigation water. system. Nothing yeah. in uh, Greece grows without water. It's impossible. Yeah. Pretty so much. I think it's like price first of all of the house and yeah, just the no, land. Yeah, price was un- uncomparable. And, and I love the change of four seasons. Like you feel the change of the four seasons. Yeah, it's obvious. And I yeah, like yeah. that switch. Like, like now the spring is coming and you really like feel it. And it's like yeah. it's so beautiful. It just everything yeah. starts to what? I don't know. It felt like lightning outside. I don't think so. I don't know. Maybe. My eyes are blinking. Could be. <laughs> A great mix of everything. That's what we look forward. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> so, what else do we have? It's funny how yeah. you, I'm not the only one calling them those crazy <laughs> Latin kids. <laughs> the video where you broke down inside of the roads, Giovanna, I was so worried for both years. <laughs> yeah, it was. That's crazy. a long time ago. Yeah. It was a very long time ago. I think that's five years ago, nearly, yeah. maybe. Yeah. If Might that's be. three, yeah, four, five, yeah, must Might be five. be five years ago, something like that. Well, I was like, whew, my very bad. <laughs> yeah, it was, we just simply just run out of diesel. It's the most dumbest thing that can happen. Marshmallow stickers. We have to actually make a merch about the... Uh, Barbara, about, yeah. With the goats that don't have horns. What? Because we have a merch from uh, Spotify oh, yeah, 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 yeah. that have horns. So we need one. But marshmallow is my favorite. Marshmallow. Yeah. My seagull. And Hoppity. And Hoppity, yes. Marshmallow and Hoppity. Those are my two favorites. Uh, no, no. Yeah. We, I have all of them. I love them. We just have to all- allocate our time better to work on these things. That's yeah. the thing. Okay. I think we should set a plan. What? No, like we should do like live stream cookings. Yeah. We said that last year, I think. Yeah, exactly we the same have thing. to. And uh, yeah, we're going to do the reacting videos as well. I yeah, think like having also, like you see, you need something, you said you need something that will boost you and motivate you to do things. So that's a very good thing to put schedules like that. <laughs> so we can be motivated and like push forward towards those. The house is very warm and cozy, but it also doesn't help in terms of like need to go work. No, yeah, no, it doesn't. Because you want to just sit inside and do nothing. 
think about making some camping spots for uh, RVers. Um, yeah. Maybe uh, not on this land, but overall on some property. Like if we buy some yeah. land, it would be really cool. No, we just, we don't really... We were planning it around my aunt's place. There yeah. was a land um, there. But it's just the cost of buying it right now and doing all that to be you yeah. know capable of hosting anyone. We're thinking about tiny homes. It's just so much that we can't just afford it, and that's it. Mm, yeah, Simple. and we don't. Price we could do up. it on our land, and my mom has suggested it many times to. But uh, it's an extra Airbnb, stress. We just not can't Airbnb, take on the extra our stress. place or like host people in our place and overall. But first of all, it's another. It's a bit. We already don't have a lot of time on our hands. No. And second of all, we since we are like online we don't want random people or people even people coming here not knowing within youtube and then figuring it out it's like yeah. they know our address it's like our family like we want to build our family in this house and we're not planning on moving or then everyone finding out our address and then you know i don't know where yeah, all yeah, of this yeah. could go it's not so so simple no but on a random land yeah we on could. a random land yeah i would mind it's nice hosting these kind of things or if you have, have for example the we airbnb the apartment in the same yeah the, the one center. in Icepute in the, it's a little city <laughs> yes. and we're definitely gonna we would definitely get you people over here and yeah. give you a tour of our place and you get to know us and get to see us but that's different because you know you already built the trust and people don't stay at your house that's like the biggest fear like we don't want random people in our house yeah so yeah that that could work together but not just like getting people here so yeah it's uh, it's a lot of projects a <laughs> lot of things to do more pound than a lake really uh the the our lake or your plans for the lake yeah it's a pond it's not yeah. really it's a hand dig the lake though it's a uh, pond uh, which is digged with shovels yeah. before even tractors were alive um, which makes it old, but we have redigged it already. So we have <laughs> so already we have ruined it. We have ruined the authenticity, but there was not much left no, of a lake. Really left. There was no lake actually. No. There was no water in it. So we need to re keep redigging it. It's not finished. We cheaped out and didn't finish. Yeah, well, we didn't have the money to do it. It, it like did help the ec ecosystem like insanely. We have yeah. frogs have come back. A lot more um, bugs that were not here, like good bugs for your garden, yeah. have come back. A lot of flowers have started growing much. Much more. I think it's giving a lot more water for the trees. An insane amount of moss everywhere. Moss has blew up, which shows that you have good air quality, specific yeah. moss. Um, so we are helping by keeping, you know, the farm fields further away because they use a lot of chemicals. So we're keeping that away, and the, the the lake really helped a lot. So we need to keep dig like keep it um, redig it to original size. Yeah. Which is a lot of work, but safety first, to privacy too. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Because if we would, we, we, yeah, with the apartment, we already have given the address all public, but our house, we don't. Apartment really is going to be public. We were, we, we have yeah. many ideas for it, but don't we'll see what's finished. I broke it already. Um, <laughs> it's already. <popped> up. <laughs> <laughs> it's perfect. Yeah. It's yeah. Perfect. It's, um, it's more like, it's not like we don't trust people. It's just, there you is, can't trust everyone. No. It's like if we say publicly now, we, we trust most of like i don't know yeah. who trusts you but there's also people with bad intentions and you know yeah, they want to ruin their jealous whatever so we don't want to put it out and then it's out forever and then we cannot go back like we cannot reverse it it's out <laughs> live stream food yeah we will we'll say about the live stream yeah. food that we cool. should or like and then you can follow the recipe or, or and we make the ah, food listen what if we give <laughs> we said that last time as well i feel like a deja vu like we make a, a post where we give you what we're gonna cook so you the can recipe, get the ingredients yeah. and then we can cook it together. That's what we said last time, but we never did it. We need to really do it. Yeah, we could Love do that. That would be cool. People cook it and then they Music. don't like it and they blame us. <laughs> 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 at least then you have someone blame. <laughs> no, no, no. We don't no. cook our animals. Not, not at all. It's uh, we, They're not raised for meat purposes. When no. you raise an animal for meat, you have to mentally be ready for that. Yes. You and cannot. Like, you I can't. never... If you have never raised animals, you would, it's hard to understand, but you can't switch from having a pet to eating it. That's like, like the same thing me, with the dogs and cats. Yes, for you me, can't physically I just... feel like marshmallow hobbity, all of my goals. Like, I couldn't... I feel them not as as close as even Kata, but like very close. Like, you couldn't yeah. take them away from me. And I wouldn't feel like having them on my plate. No, no, if, no. That's if you raise them fully with the intention that you will have to do yeah. that, then okay. It's uh, it's not like I'm against the whole thing. It's no, no. Uh, sustainable and stuff, but um, then you have to, it's different mindset. It's different mindset. Exactly. Same with geese or sheep or anything or cows or. We are actually yeah, yeah. the sheep that we wanna bring to your uncle and yeah. aunt. They will be for like 
reproducing meat, yeah. and meat. So that that's why we want to also bring them there so we also don't get so attached to them. And it's purely for that. But whatever is here will stay here and will not get processed. Yeah, geese. Geese can be uh, good. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, yeah, it's um, true about geese. Geese are. Um, but no one saw it. No, yeah, no, no one saw it. It's we saw it. <laughs> no, said, someone said that they are geese are um, pretty mean. Yeah, boom holes. Yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> to hide the word from YouTube. Um, no, geese. Yeah, um, they are very bad. They're mean. They're very. Mean. Once, once, once their uh, mating, mating season is over, uh, they become like a game kind. Like yeah. the my big Pew Pew, he's yeah. so kind to me, so friendly. But now the girl is so, so aggressive, so try. screaming. They just don't come near. Like you can't get near them. Another thing, like I could have geese, like a full like fifty geese, and knowing that those will go for me, I wouldn't have a problem. But it, with the small ones that we have, like the small amount, you are attached to them. So yeah, male goats, them. they're not mean. I think our boys, uh, boys are more kind than the girls. They are more loving and caring, oh. but they're definitely stinky. That's oh, male 100%. goats, male goats. Yeah, a lot of people say that they're very mean and punching around. But no. our Maxi boy, he's the biggest like baby boy. He's a, literally <laughs> like a baby. He, he acts like a baby. He's so kind, so grateful. He understands when he messes up. Yeah, he's scared. He bit. He chewed. By the way, he killed the cable of the solar panel. Solar panel. So solar power is gone from their house. They, he threw the cable to nothing. It's not the, anything left. He threw it without electricity. He unplugged it from the solars <laughs> and chose it. And I can't plug it back in because he has chewed it yeah. you know, to dead. But so, that's okay. Um, he understood. I showed him the cable. He's scared. He's out of the house. He knew, like, who did this. And yeah. He, got... he just... You don't need to do anything. But they stink. Yes, away. they do stink. Of course, they pee But only themselves. boys. Only boys. Uh, you should be only the season, but ours do all, all year round. I don't know. They're fine. They pee all the time. <laughs> they pee all the time. But um, our... For example, our... Um, Ram, yeah, Ram, that's what it's called in uh, male uh, sheep. He's uh, so kind as well. He's not uh, aggressive at all, like most of them should be. Oh, uh, yeah, your mom has work. She's leaving. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, we have to also finish yeah. my throat. So in 10 hurt. minutes, I think. Like, I have to have a tea. Nine minutes. So it's exactly two hours. I think last time we also did two hours. <laughs> You're definitely not afraid from hard work. Uh, it's not like I love hard work, but um, it, it has to it, be done. It motivates me as well. It's not the worst. I, I can definitely yeah. do it. So... They're your animals, so it's no one's business what to do with them. Yes. Of course, always. That's, with mm -hmm. everything, I, at the end of the yeah. day, it's our responsibility or our fault. Like, yeah. On everything. <laughs> but we, of course, we take opinions and we... Yeah, uh, of course, we accept and we never take like the negative comments. It's like, oh, they're being mean to us. Oh, like, yeah, yeah, we yeah, of course, accept yeah. it. It's everyone's opinion. So, yeah. Um, yeah. But yeah, um, I think we're going to finish it now. More or less, yeah. Because <laughs> it's nearly two hours. Exactly. <laughs> And my throat hurts. Need so, I, did we sell, sell everything? I think so. I think so, yeah. Mm. Water su secure. Yes, yeah. water supply is perfect. Water is we'll drinkable. Time. It's certified to be perfect for drinking, yeah. perfect for consuming for food. And it tastes so pure and so clean. And it's just a lot of it. Where we cannot use it up. You could shower air. Yeah. Your life? Yeah, I disconnected for a second. But yeah, oh, that's a okay. sign. That's I mean, I think internet is dying because yeah, it's, oh, it's eight o'clock and that means people are gonna watch news. That's yeah. the problem. <laughs> so problem with the news okay, is gonna... everyone's gonna watch it. Um TikToks or Instagram. We do some some, but not a we lot. We try. I mean it's a lot of like things to yeah. follow after and uh, I'd rather spend time with my girl <laughs> doing that. Yeah. Wanna have some more free time. And uh, what something I want to say about the animals, I forgot. So Oh yeah, one last thing I want to say. I might we might say in one of the videos, but there was a lot of comments like also one year ago, and um, or I don't know if people what commenting. What? No, like it's very expensive to have animals. And no, our, our animal cost I think is probably under a thousand per year. What? Less. Even less. Maybe. A thousand? Where are you finding the thousand from? I guess it's Harold. <laughs> we bought way too many, for example. Yes. And uh, a roll, the one big roll that you see. Costed 12 euros, which is close to $12 for one giant roll that lasts us a week. Two weeks nearly. Two weeks, yes, actually. Like so. one and a half. Like we're giving them way too much, so that's why it lasts a week. Yeah, we are overfeeding we're them. We're overfeeding, overfeeding them. But that's so, why they also keep their yeah. house clean. We said we're going to finish it. People are saying bye bye. Okay, so that's I what think, I want to say. Yeah. I don't know. I 
had it in my head all the time. Having animals for us is cheap, so don't worry about that. Yeah. Uh, I think the projects are much more expensive. Oh, yeah, the project. It's not like I'm <laughs> like other countries. But we love places. doing it. That's the thing. It's it's okay. Okay, bye-bye. We're going to see you next yeah. time. Uh, hope in you enjoyed. <laughs> an actual video, yeah. We're going to see you tomorrow because you said you like the reacting video. So yeah, we hopefully. might do that tomorrow. Hopefully it's going to be interesting. Let yeah. us know about your feedback. And uh, yeah, we love reading your comments. And uh, we we'll read support. every comment, but we maybe don't have the time to answer. But don't worry, we read. No, the yeah, we like it, and we have it in our head. We might reply it in one of the other videos. Yeah, or we keep it in mind sometimes <laughs> if we don't want to just reply in the comment. But yeah, yeah. hope you enjoy. We're gonna see you and next we're time. We're gonna see you tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> Get it.